Well, 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 hello everyone. Welcome to the Find Your Blueprints, but again. Hello everyone in the chat over there. Today a coup is hosting another server. Oh my god, I hate these floating heads. A coup is hosting another server with 40 players. Um, this... Uh, I, I'm gonna... I will try and explain what this mod does in a bit. It is the Find Your Blueprints mod we did the last... Why do I have this enabled? <laughs> we did the Find Your Blueprints mod about a, two weeks ago, something like that. And uh, it didn't work because we messed something up. However, this time it works. I should probably give out the server password. Then the password is a huge joke. Like, uh, you're gonna laugh when you hear the password because it literally is a joke. So, anyways, what this mod does. What this mod does is makes all of these recipes deleted. As you can see, there's no science tab because you can't have science. In order to craft anything, you have to get blueprints. In order to get blueprints, why are you killing butterflies as Wigford? In order to get blueprints, you have to do certain actions to get certain blueprints. There's actually a site that explains all of this. Um, uh, this place. Um, if you kill the ancient fuel weaver, you get a dark sword blueprint. If you want a crock pot, you have to kill the ancient guardian. Donate for every five. Yeah. Um, if you want a regal shovel, you have to chop a blue mush tree. Some of these are like a 1% chance. If you just do it enough times, you'll get the blueprint. Here's my favorite one. If you want a backpack, you have to kill Chester. That's right, you, you have to become a murderer if you want a backpack. You have to kill Chester. There's a bunch of these ones. There's just a lot of them. Oh, hello. Looks like people are joining. I'm gonna... Go try and make something. Oh no, that was a mistake looking at the thing. Now, all the resources are looted. Quickly, take the flint. Oh, it tells you the recipe. So every time you pick a sapling, you have a 0.75% chance to get a spear wig for the get out of here. And a 0.25% chance to get a fence blueprint. Can you please test if you can block Dragonfly or be queen with walls? It, uh, actually, I should test that later after the stream. I'll make like a full video on the y-axis. It's gonna be an amazing video. If we chop trees, we can get a chest or boards. If we get grass, we can get rope or wood walls. It's pretty low. Like 0.75% chance. If we want, if we want to get rope, like we have to pick 125 grass, I think, which is kind of insane. Oh, hey, you have stuff. I think I should make, hello. Um, so the reason I chose Maxwell is because I knew people would rob us of our resources so I can uh, do this and make a shadow miner and he'll slave us. Wait. Oh my god, I'm a... I'm a... Okay, sorry about that. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> that was intentional, you see. Now you guys don't know where I am. So now I can't be followed. So, um... If you hover, hover over certain stuff, like this boulder... 4% chance to get the... Electrical doodad blueprint. And that's how you're... I don't want this pickaxe, but thank you. If you hover over the rock, 2.5% chance for both a fire pit blueprint and a regular tin blueprint. I am very smart, man. That whole uh, 
putting up the wrong screen thing was intentional, by the way. I am a genius. Hello, Talbert. If you kill the Talbert, you get a... Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't think it's worth it to kill the Talbert. And yes, unless you're Wigford. Yes. Kill him. What's he? Go. You just tank, man. You're Wigford. You can handle ev anything. It says server is full. 23 out of 40. Okay, if you're stuck loading, um... Oh, no blueprint that time. If you're stuck loading for too long in the server, um... It means you won't get in. It's some weird don't starve bug. Oh my god, he's on TV. That's crazy. Yeah, if you're taking too long to... If it takes you too long to connect, just, um... Disconnect. No one's collecting any stuff. I, I would think that by now I would be getting robbed. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Um, who gave me frog legs? Why would you give me frog legs? Okay, you know what? I shouldn't complain. We're getting free stuff. I am a god. I can make infinite ax- Oh, I just made two axes. Someone take that. I can make a shadow logger and a shadow miner and an infinite pickaxe. And an infinite axe. Is Gamer Man controlling the Gamer Man? Most likely. Alright. So our ob Oh god. Yeah, I'm using I'm using my phone to read chat. That's a big mistake. I my my plan for today is to try and build a base. So if we chop enough trees, we might get a chest blueprint. So that's my first goal. Where's Orange Man? Look guys, I have the coordinates mod. You can figure it out where I am, clearly. Just, just use the coordinates to follow me to where I am. It can't be that hard at all. Nice, we have a torch going. Um, Wax will gaming. Face cam, where's my face cam? Well, you see. Uh, Max will gaming... Uh, uh, he's, um, he died in a horrible accident. He, he, he was found laying at his computer. And, and when the doctors examined the body, it was proved he died of gaming overdose. He tried to play Don't Star for longer than two hours, and he, um, his heart couldn't take the action. Maybe he'll come back though, who knows. He can resurrect after all. He's a gamer. He responds. He can never truly die. My god, that is some... <gasps> board's blueprint! We got a board blueprint. Okay, I think that's enough to summon Maxwell Gaming. Boards. Everyone knows he loves boards. And this time he is advanced. Well, actually... I'm not sure if you would call... You know, what is your... What is your guys' opinion of mobile gaming? Is it like... Good gaming? Or is mobile gaming bad gaming? Like, what, what do you think of playing games on your phone? Because, um... Maxwell Gaming... Has returned. But he's now a mobile gamer. <laughs> It's, it's a problem. The resurrection didn't go so well. This is a good drawing. Meat good has drawn an epic Maxwell Gaming. Again. Oh, I got a rain hat blueprint. Who gave me that? Orange, who's everyone and why do they like boards? I don't know, man. <laughs> yes, we got a blueprint for the face scam. Let's learn the boards blueprint. Now we can craft a board. Amazing. Um, how do we get a sign blueprint? Because everybody knows that every good base needs a sign. Um, sign. 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 Maxwell Gaming Mobile. He's playing Flappy Bird Mobile? Oh my god, he is! He's stronger than I thought. I thought Maxwell Gaming is just devolved, but in reality... He upgraded. He's playing Flappy Bird Mobile. Oh man, that's um, great. 
Wait, I can F3 sign. Mini sign? Directional sign and home sign. Loon tree? Well, I have to chop loon trees to get a sign? Are you joking me? Okay, how do I make a boat? Oh, you can't make a boat. <laughs> okay then. Well, what else can we create? Let's try and get a chest. This time I won't forget to turn it off. Oh, hello. <laughs> um... I believe if we, yeah, 1.5% chance to get a chest. If we chop enough trees, we will get a chest blueprint. He's playing Don't Starve New Horn. New Horn. Mmm. He's playing Don't Starve New Horn. Interesting game you've chosen to play there, Maxwell. I, uh... Don't know what to think of it. So, hopefully, during this server... He oh, someone found Chester. Now here's the predicament. If you kill Chester, you get a blueprint. You, you can make a backpack with that blueprint that you get from killing Chester. It's a 100% chance. What's that? We have a chest! Pat Furek, thank you, my man. To honor this Weber, we'll build him a chest. It's called Pat Furek's chest. There you go. Everything in here belongs to Pat Furek. There you go. Max will get out of his chest. That's that's not your chest. The server passes joke, right? Yeah. He's playing shipwreck. The mad expression on his face is like mine when I die from poison. Yeah, poison is a uh, pretty annoying. But by that same logic, he could theoretically be playing Hamlet. Anyways. Chester and the backpack. Whoever found Chester, if you kill Chester, you get a 100% chance for a backpack blueprint. Which means, you could kill Chester for a backpack. That's kind of obvious, right? I don't know why I'm still chopping trees, but we'll go along with it. So, um, there's, a, there's kind of a dilemma here. Once you get the backpack blueprint, and you craft your backpack. You can do one of two things. You can craft a backpack for yourself and then like craft backpacks for everyone else. Or you could only craft a backpack for yourself and then leave everyone else to suffer and then just force other people to kill Chester. Both? Rip Chester? They killed him already. Okay. <laughs> it was also good to see you could use Chester as a backpack, but clearly that idea didn't last very long. Let's make base right here. Who says... wait. No, let's not make base here. Let's build it at spawn. I make... Wait, call me logic is the guy... Where... He's the guy who has the Chester blueprint. What is this orange thing? That Maxwell's playing on. It says it's it says clay on it, I think. Hamlet is not on mobile. <laughs> um He has the clay phone. He can do anything on it. He can play Hamlet on mobile if he really wants to. Um what can we get from boulders? Why is it not showing me? What is this cheating going on? Oh wait, no, it just tells you when people get blueprints. That's cool. You want a hat orange? Yes, llama man. I will give you a rain hat blueprint so you too can have a hat one day. Llama man. Alright, we have the Maxwell Gaming hat. Official merch you can buy in the fourth dimension. Qualf and trunk, where are people getting this stuff? You know, I'm not even gonna complain. This is good for me. We need grass. I think. More importantly though, we need to go to spawn so we can build the base. Why are everyone giving me their food? I feel important. You know, normally people would be trying to kill me. Today is not 
One of those days. <laughs> Maxwell is cracking 90s in Fortnite. Says Rick G. Yeah, he's pirating some stuff on his phone. You know, he could be doing theoretically anything and we wouldn't know. Anyways, here's our ba Oh yeah! To get presents, you, you do it at a campfire in this mod, because there's no science machine. We have our spawn base now. We can cook food. Who's Who gave me grass? Oh my god, this is amazing. We have Warly and a crockpot. Just a spite monkey. He's called a monkey. Just a spite Warly, I'm not gonna use the crockpot. At all, I'm gonna just cook everything as normal. Who died? He died. Maxwell Gaming needs food. I'm not starving, I'm winning. Where's the Bloons Monkey game? <laughs> Where is the Bloons Monkey game? Is this Peace Club? Actually, you know what? People are friendly today. Thank you, Higgsbury on drugs, for giving me the, I mean, the wound grass. You know what? Today is a peaceful day. This is Peace Land. If only we had a sign. We can't get a sign because it requires lunar trees. Here's, here's a public chest. Enjoy. And you know what? Here's another public chest. We can all share things now. Take some rocks. And maybe wood. With the new Y axis information, <laughs> Maxwell Gaming can finally learn to crank 90s in DST. Someone said Bloods TD6. Maxwell Gaming is playing BTD6! You're right. That's the only game you could be playing. Hold on, let's open. <laughs> He's playing BTD6 on his phone. What a gamer. What do you, what do we need for a think tank? Uh, Willow, there's no there's no science machine, alchemy engine, boat. Sign alchemy engine, science machine. Red cap, thank you, Frozen Rabbit. And there's no Shadow Manipulator or anything like that. He's using your Dart Monkey strat. Wait, guys, some, some say if you listen closely, you can hear the BTD6 music. Damn, he really is gaming. Well, I, I turn your volume down, Max. I'm trying to goddamn stream. You know? Okay. Our next objective, our next objective will be to um, find something else we can craft. Because we got that chest way too fast. It kind of helped that um, we had a bunch of people helping us. So, what about walls? Wall. Antlion for a stone wall. He's angry because he died at Muddy Waters Chimps round 5. Yeah, I, I I feel the pain. Let's let's see. Antline for a stone wall is like garbage. Grass and grass gecko for a hay wall. Hmm. We could get a hay wall. Maybe make a base out of hay wall. Where's the next wall? Meteor boulder and suspicious moon rocks. I don't think we can find enough of those. And for a wood wall, spiky tree and tumbleweed. Tumbleweed? Actually. Chat, do we build our base out of hay walls or wood walls? Actually, the answer is hay walls, right? Because, well, actually. No, the answer is hay walls, because no matter what we do, we need um, rope. And to get rope is the same way you get a hay wall. So... Let's go try and get, let's, let's go find a, a grass biome with lots of grass. That sounds like a plan to me, I think. Let's try and also get food so we don't die. We got so we got wood walls from Tumbleweed, which, which could be cool. Is that a bishop head? Absolutely disgusting. Who built that there? Where do we go? Hmm. It's so strange to hear my sister watching this too. Why did Eber delete his message? I'm suspicious now. Why is your sister watching this too? 
should be watching this on the same 400 times 1000 monitor. Alright. I don't know where grass is because the spawn is um, literally all looted. You, you, you won't find anything here. So uh, I have to find grass, which is not, not a fun task at all. Um, I, is that a, ooh, where do you go? Where's this path? Does this path go to Pigkin? This might go to Pigkin. I will flare Bee Queen and a Touchstone. Oh, I could found a Bee Queen and a Touchstone. Wait, are we killing a Bee Queen? Do we kill Bee Queen? Do we kill Bee Queen? What happens if we kill Bee Queen? Let's go kill Bee Queen. Okay, I guess it's settled then. We're killing Bee Queen. <laughs> yes, sure. Okay then. What, wait, first, what do you get from killing a uh, Bee Queen? Let's see. Bee... Honey poultice, wax paper, and two random recipes. Okay, so we could theoretically get anything from killing um, Bee Queen. Because there, there's two random recipes, but... Doesn't sound too bad. Lazy Llama has a weapon for us. That sounds like gaming. Let's go. Kill Bee Queen. Every stream we must kill Bee Queen. Wait. And there's a touchstone beside Bee Queen. So even if you die, you can revive. If I understand that correctly. Huh. Okay. At the start, I had no twigs and I mean I had no grass and a lot of twigs and now I have no twigs and a lot of grass um yeah I, I would make a weapon but I can't also there's no caves so I guess we can't kill the ancient guardian I eat Wilson's for breakfast says Miss Dragon you eat the Wilson cereal box oh hey all right boys how the hell did you craft that already Beekeeper hat. You are insane. Justice the awesome demon, man. You know what we need? You, you know what every good bee queen battle needs? What is this over here? Oh, they destroyed the Maxwell Gaming statue. God the... Cactus? There's three cactus here. There must be a desert nearby. There must be a desert nearby. Maxwell came and reads chat on that mobile phone. Stop calling me out, man. Maybe it's true. Ooh, weapons. Thank you, whoever made these. Alright. Are we ready for the Bee Queen battle? Oh, campfire. We can cook. Fry Talbert bag. Thank you, whoever gave me that. And a stick. That's good. Let's cook our seeds. We, there's, like, no food. If you play in a world with, like, 40 players, there's no food. People just eat all of it. Also, does anyone have a hammer? Because hammers are kind of essential if you want to kill Bee Queen. Does, does anyone have a hammer? Only rich people have grass on this server. That's true. I have a hammer? Okay. That's good. I, I hope the Bee Queen recipes are actually good. Bee Queen isn't ready for Maxwell Game in the Mobile Edition. That's true, I mean... Imagine... Imagine being beaten by a guy in like an FPS game. And then you find out he's like playing on mobile. That's like the... Way to assert dominance. Oh, hey, it's Weber from the Nothing World. Oh, let's go. Our phones. Let's go. He's playing, um... Hold F Simulator. How's it going? It's going pretty well. Actually. The streaming is always fun. Uh, uh, Q makes me go in first person. You guys like Cursed Perspectives? I like, I sure do love Cursed Perspectives. I can't even hit her. 
Because people, let's go. We have turned DST into a first person medieval battle simulator. I wanna hook up with them grass dealers. Yeah, I, I really need some grass. I, actually, I have 14, I think I'm fine. I am the grass dealer. Who said Biku? Well, at least we can respawn. <gasps> My stuff, no! No! <laughs> My grass! Ah! Oh. That's a. Uh, that's an F right there. I just. Uh, whoever set. I would like to have a word with whoever set B Queen on fire. It was you, wasn't it, Imp? You deserve that lightning strike. Yeah, slime the slime. <laughs> Why orange? I'm gonna I'm gonna blame Uh oh. What did we get? We got a bug net, a backpack, and a bug net. We got two bug net recipes. And butter. So that was pretty useless. Dude, we killed a bee queen for two bug net recipes. Why, why would why would we need a bug net recipe? Okay. Oh, I lost my Maxwell Gaming book. This this has to be the worst day of my life. I lost my Maxwell Gaming book. What the hell? Oh, I got my hat back. Thank you. We lost the gaming book. Dude. That book... Told you Maxwell Gaming is bad at gaming. I blame the phone, man. That book has a guide on how to beat every level in Flappy Bird Mobile. Um, we, we, we can't beat Flappy Bird Mobile without electrical do that recipe. That is the most useless thing. A tentacle spike. Thank you, whoever gave me. <laughs> You know, Maxwell is playing the long game. He's not. He, he doesn't. He doesn't care about short-term goals like um, beating B Queen. He's. He cares about the long game. He cares about what he's gonna. Where he's gonna base. <laughs> I walk the neighbor's dog. Yep. Okay. Where? All of this grass is gone. Apparently there was a desert nearby. But all I see is beefalos who don't seem to give blueprints. Thanks for the red caps, man. Now I appreciate it. Truly. Oh. <gasps> grass. 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 No one's been here yet. We can establish our grass empire. Maybe get some rope or some grass walls. Maybe grass walls for the base. At least you can't burn D fly. I have your stuff. <laughs> That's your stuff. Thank you, Lava Man. I appreciate my stuff back. Do you think Don't Starve Together will come to mobile? Expensive present? I don't think it'll come to mobile. There's like New Home or whatever that is. But that's like a different game. Not made by Clay. And it's not what Maxwell is playing over there. In the corner. Hire a helmet slave. Um. Isn't everyone my helmet slave? I kind of have an army going. Flare D-Fly. Oh, we're killing D-Fly now. Amazing. I have to figure out I'm gonna get this book back. Oh, Papyrus has its own recipe too. This is That's actually super difficult to make. And on top of that, I need to get Nightmare Fuel as Maxwell, the guy who always has like full sanity. Give me silk and I can make a game in hats. Why'd you give me 11 flint? Actually, you know what? Lamp oil, rope, bombs? You, you skipped like three lines.
Um, okay. Is that a... I don't trust any beeflo anymore. Last time I got murdered by one that was standing. We need more people, Aku. Okay. Lucky for you, I have like an army and a half coming. Why is it says server is full but it's 39 out of 40? There's one guy who's stuck on a loading screen. He will never actually make it into the server. He's just stuck on like a forever loading screen. If you, if you load into the server for too long and you're just stuck on that loading screen for too long, you have to disconnect. Otherwise you take up a slot by not being in the server. Oh hello Jakey Source. When is Maxwell came in getting drippy? Okay, no, we, we gave him drip last time. And that's enough drip, okay? We we can't give him more. Oh a touchstone near Dragonfly. This is suspiciously convenient. That the two touchstones in the world were near the two bosses. Uh okay, I guess we can start. Guys? Maxwell Gaming is not afraid, even though you can probably one-shot me, yes. Gaming moment. She's sleeping in a battle. Weakling. I have four Telltale Hearts. So if I get unlucky and she decides to hit me out of everyone there... Um... Yeah, I'm instantly dead, because she does 75 damage and I have 75 health. Crawling horror, wait, hold on. How the hell do I have this much grass? Okay, I guess I'm rich now. Who's giving me all this stuff? <laughs> what is that blueprint? I want it. Floral shirt. That's literally useless, because summer isn't a thing. Alright, kill dragonfly. Uh oh, I just hit a creature. Hit dragonfly, please. Hey there, and we can stun her. Why am I burning? Burning is not good. Oh! I have four stacks of grass. <laughs> five stacks of grass. Five stacks of grass. Maxwell is um a bit rich. Sorry, Maxwell. I can't give credit. Come back when you're a little richer in grass. Oh, is she dead? Did we kill Dragonfly? Or did she despawn? What happened? We did it? What did you get? Scaled Furnace? And that's it. Okay. What does this mod do? Oh, so basically... Thank you for the elect... Floral Shirt Blueprint. Basically, science machines are disabled. Um. You can't craft anything the normal way. In order to unlock all the recipes, you have to find blueprints. In order to get blueprints, we have there's a website here that tells you how to get all of them. But basically, it's like you kill you kill the ancient guardian for the crockpot recipe. If you pick enough grass, you can um, you have a small chance of getting the rope recipe or the um. Hey wall recipe, stuff like that. More shoe, but it's Rook Gaming talking to Maxwell Gaming about being richer. Wilson comes into Maxwell's shop without any grass. Asking to buy rope, gunpowder, and light bulbs. Yes, now let's pick tumbleweed. I have no space. Let's just learn these blueprints. Because if I drop them, people are just going to give them back to me. And that's... Okay, watch this strategy. Eat red cap. Eat butterfly wings. You thought I was memeing. I can't eat because people are pushing me. They're going to push me to the magma pool. I can't move. Why can't I move? No! No, 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 fuck, no. noob gamer, why? <laughs> I think someone's tried to kill me and someone's tried to save me. Please, stop pushing me, I, I don't, I don't like this. Oh, oh. Run, 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 run. Get out of here. Get out of here. 
get out of here. Um, so, we have a problem. Everyone is following me instead of trying to make a base. We need to build a base. I will not stand still. Um, we need to make a base. We, and to make a base, we need materials. We need walls to protect us from pesky hounds. Why can't Virgin Wilson be a gamer? Well, um, here's the thing. Wilson does not play BTD6 on his phone like Maxwell over here. And that's why he can never be a gamer. Why do we have so much grass? Should we question that? Let's, nah, let's just... Forget about it. Is there any clockworks? I think clockworks give you something. Does this give me anything? I have four rope. Okay. How, how did you get that? Cactus doesn't give you anything. Spiky bush should give you something. It's not showing up. Hmm. Labwell ropes bobs you wanted. It's yours my friend as long as you have enough grass. Yeah, I think gaming that's correct They're trying to fatten and season Maxwell for the upcoming Maxwell roast You really messed up going into a corner. Yeah, I did Um, Okay Do we do we donate grass to the poor? Maybe that's why they're chasing me. Because I have like 99% of the cash on this server. Even though grass is worthless. Because it's, it's not. Wait a. Oh, I can flex on these guys. I think I know the problem. They just want cowboy hats. Enjoy my people. Take the cowboy hats. And do great things with them. Drop this. Oh my god. Well. I don't even have to play the game anymore. They can just play it for me. Where are we going, guys? Where Where's the hive mind gonna take us? Where should we go? What do we do? Someone just died. Should try and kill Deerclops and Berger. <laughs> Boy, we need blueprints for dinner. Uh, we killed Beakwee and Dragonfly, so I don't think Deerclops will be a problem if we can even get to him. Aha, I escaped your silly hive mind. What if? Okay, let's, you know, I'm feeling a little bit uh, introverted. Let's go to Pigkin, my man. Boom. They will never find me. They don't know where I am. I'm hidden from view. Now, someone mined the Glomer statue. Now, slide in Max for gaming. Now, with all those people gone, we have to do some stuff. Um, I didn't drop all these straw hats, that's a shame. We we I, we lost our co gaming book because someone stole it when we died. It's my birthday. Can you make something? I want you to make and don't starve together. Okay. Well, anyways, maybe the gaming book we can't really do anything with. There's some wood here, because we can't get papyrus unless we get the blueprint. Wait, how do we get? Oh, we might die. Wait, let me get a torch. How do we get papyrus? Maybe maybe it's not hard. It's pap Uh where read. Oh. Okay, every time you pick reads, you have a chance to get um what are they called? Uh, papyrus. Okay. So if we just find the swamp, pick reeds, we could maybe get this book back. 
Although it's gonna be hard. No, it's not my birthday. Somebody in chat had a birthday. Um. Yeah, let's just get this. You know what this world needs? It needs a chest with a bunch of cowboy hats. So the lucky person who finds this can enjoy not one, not two, but four straw hats that look like cowboy hats. Oh, hi. <laughs> and I, our army is growing. We have a Maxwell and he gave me a gnome. Thank you. Do not take read. Can you make Survivor and Don't Starve together? I don't know how I would even do that. Oh, why did I open the map? Oh no. Oh, people know where I am. Weber from the Nothing World, do not snitch my location. I have Papyrus Blueprint. Where are you, Malays? <laughs> hmm. Well, if that's the case, all we need is a two Nightmare Fuel, which is kind of difficult. Unless we find a wormhole. It's not my birthday, goddammit. <laughs> oh no. Um, who killed all these butterflies? I'm not complaining. So, I think we could get Nightmare Fuel. We just have to... The way, we, the way we're gonna get it is to find a wormhole and... Um, feather Hat? Okay, that's a good threat for... Spaghetti, you gave me a pan flute. Okay, I am this man. Give me something else now. Living logs. Okay, take red caps. What are you guys giving me? Yeehaw. <laughs> Cat tails. I don't want your garbage. Give me it again. Why is he... Are you gonna burn that? Are you gonna burn that? Or is he leaving the server? Spaghetti was gonna go. Maybe, I'm not sure. What is he doing? Why did you drop everything you had? 6 a.m. sleep time. Good night, okay. He has to go now. Happy birthday to Maxwell Gaming. Why is it? <laughs> Feather hat provides small sanity burp. It's not my goddamn birthday. It's the 10th of February. That is a uh, date. Where is the wormhole? I don't see a wormhole. That's a bit sad. We got two living logs. So I can't be mad. Um. Wait, maybe... No. Um, where is, uh, why, where is a wormhole? Wilson, what the hell, man? Troll is this? He almost trollized me. That is uh, not gaming. Is this a mod? Yes. Um... What time is, is it for you? It is currently 6.45 p.m. Does anyone have two nightmare fuel? It's not my birthday, god damn it! Uh, wormhole in the Maxwell's room? Where's the Maxwell's room? Near D-Fly? Where's D-Fly? I don't even remember. She's there. Oh, it's a wormhole right there, you're right! Alright, I gave you Nightmare Fuel? Oh, you did! Okay, thank you. Thank you, Mr... I can't read your name because the game is booked. Crimson Dragon. So now we just need... Now we need Papyrus. Wherever a swamp is. Um, Someone, someone in chat who's an expert. How old are you now? I, <laughs> I am the same age I was yesterday because it's not my birthday. Uh, where is the swamp? Um, maybe this wormhole will take me to the swamp. Cause think about it, I don't see a wormhole. 
anywhere else on this map. So therefore, this will take me to an unexplored location. Which, I'm just listening to the stream while playing Bloons TD6. Amazing. Alright, now that you are listening to me, you have to buy, a. Uh, you have to buy a uh, Apache Prime, but with the garbage cross path, the middle cross path. I want you to suffer while playing BTD6. This wormhole took me nowhere. Okay then. It's your death day the day you die. There's a wormhole near spawn that goes to swamp. Okay. Oh hey, it's my chest. Where's spawn? I do not remember. Apparently there's a wormhole near there. But that's too far. Let's... What is that? It's a chest blueprint. That's amazing. Look at this world gen. It's like a tiny bridge. Yesterday he was a child and now he's a big man. S Spike Storm Smart Upgrades. Yeah, buy that as well. A cube can you t Call me Logic. Backpack. I need space. Okay, call me logic, man. You have two backpack blueprints? I have a lot of grass. I can actually craft people backpacks. Um, who's that? Where is call me logic? You know what? I'm gonna go to pig king. I'm gonna go to pig king. I'm gonna wait there. It's my grandma's birthday today. Yeah, you know what? Maybe you can somehow convert all the birthdays. In the chat to the gran to your grandma, maybe it's possible. Found the swamp. Okay, I want a backpack. See, this is what it's all about. If we, if one person gets the backpack blueprint, everyone can have the backpack blueprint. But will he give everyone the backpack blueprint? I've collected over two hundred grass. That man sounds extremely rich. Did you know that Maxwell is the former king of the Nightmare Throne and an egomaniac to boot? That means it's your birthday. No, the mock has no. Can you do capitalist server again? Maybe someday I might. Cause it does sound like a fun mod if we could make it to winter and beyond. <laughs> and maybe without PvP, I don't know. Now we wait. Bird hat again is assembled and it contains of only me because I have no friends. Alright. I have a gamer hat for you. It cannot be more gamer than the bird hat. <laughs> I don't speak English. But it's okay to see in the Google Translator. I don't understand anything you say. Now we wait for the man to come. Gaming hat. Garland! Oh my god, it's the pro gamer hat. Take this. <laughs> this whole server has just devolved into hat trading. This server is just like Team Fortress 2. People keep giving me hats and I keep giving hats back to them. It's great. Do pigs give you anything? No, pigs are stupid. Where is my man with the uh, backpack recipe? I'm at Pig King. Do you speak England? I do not speak England because uh, English is a hard language. Please say me in a video. Okay, Canyon Aruzu. Is that how you pronounce that? Maybe. I made that hat. What other hats can we make? We can make a rabbit ear muff. Or a floral shirt. But Rob his stuff, rob his stuff. He stole the blueprint. Floral shirt. <laughs> Did Dragonfly get floral shirt? Poor Pinexy man. He just lost all his stuff. I would never die and lose all my stuff. Can you say happy birthday, Think Gaming? Why would I ever say that? Who gave me one papyrus? Whoever did that is a gamer and a half. You guys want to see me sell this gnome? 
Should we sell this gnome? I am thinking... Oh. I'm thinking about the financial benefits. So we, our company has lost a lot of money. How did you get a handbag? And I'm... I, I just thought... I, th I think this gnome may be the cause of it. Should we sell him? Difficult decision. Tactic. Hmm. Well, whatever the case is, we can now buy the gaming book. Because someone gave me two papyrus. And a handbag. Huh. I still don't know where the... Um... He's too valuable, don't sell gnome. Sell gnome, yes, yes. Hmm. He's too valuable. You, you said no, that's a pretty good point. I won't sell the gnome, I've changed my mind. He's a... He's a valuable asset to our... Uh, Company, what do we sell? We sell, we mass produce Combrex Umbras, Umbras, also known as the Maxwell Gaming Book. Why are we surrounded in Pitkin with trees? Carl, why? Okay. We can make lots of stuff actually, hold on. Because uh, we can do this and like then go. You stole my gaming book, give me that back. Mugged. Listen, buddy, I have a, I have a handbag. I will beat you with my meat. Okay. I don't know how... Oh, okay. Let's... We, I have... I have... Uh, let's go next. Uh, what's something no one will ever find? Maybe there's a rook in this world. There's no rook in this world. Maybe there's a knight in this world. There's no knight in this world. <laughs> Maybe there's a bishop. Okay, there's no bishop. Cool. I guess I'll just have to deal with being robbed. Hello everyone, join on me. Orange is sucky to see grave. Um, I don't want to drop my max. Okay, what if I drop it behind the tree where no one can see it? You need nightmare fuel to make shadow loggers? That is a scam and a half. Okay. Give me that. Okay, we need nightmare fuel apparently. So I have to jump through a wormhole, I guess? I'm a genius selling logs to Maxwell. That man has dominated the economy. He is. Why would you go near a bishop to escape people so they wouldn't... <laughs> if anyone wants to play BT6 co-op. There's a code in there to play BT6 co-op. I have nightmare fuel for you? Okay. I demand the nightmare fuel for the uh, base. Hello. Take it there? Did you drop it? You may have dropped it. <laughs> they dropped the nightmare fuel and someone stole it. <laughs> oh no. Try to read my name. Alright, watch this. Ammo or blog das Irma's back at 2010. I just sped on failure. Well, I have Guardian's horn. He's in Aku is in the ruins. Wait, Aku is a crockpot. What if we based in the ruins? Why is Zap Trap playing BTD6? <laughs> um, yeah, the best way I see to get Nightmare Fuel as of right now is to spam the wormhole. Um, yeah. Wormhole time. This is, uh, um, spamming wormholes to lower your sanity is actually, like, it, it's kind of surprising how little people do this. Like, it's, it's free sanity, um, 
It's a completely free way to reduce your sanity. Like, it costs you nothing. You don't even have to eat anything. You can do it forever. But not many people use it. It's pretty effective. Just spam the wormhole, you lose 15 sanity every time. Zap trap is in my BTD6 lobby? <laughs> What's going on in that BTD6 lobby? What map is it? What are you guys doing? I need answers. We need an update on how your gaming balloon game is going. Locks hard default. Alright, I want you to beat round 100 with only dart monkeys. Have fun. We are almost there. I have the nightmare fuel for you, but I can't find you. Now that's a shame. We are doing it. We are gonna get our hands dirty. And we will get the nightmare fuel ourselves. Watch out for that. Yes, beat round 100 with only dart monkeys. Oh, they killed some stuff already. What? <laughs> what? I don't even know why I have this mod enabled. It's, it's a small bit of a mistake. Alright, nightmare fuel. Nightmare fuel. What the? Did you. What did he just drop? What the hell did he just drop? What did he- what did that creature just drop? What? What did he drop? Are you not gonna learn the blueprint? Did you buy and sell the game stocks- stop stocks? No. Well apparently it's a very uh... Interesting way to make money. What? What blueprint did that guy get from the nightmare creature? I'm so curious. He's not, like, using it or anything. Well. Regardless. Shadow Logger. And my book has been robbed. Again. Why is my life painful? Back. <gasps> Call me logic is... Oh my god, thank you. What is this? Gift. How did you get a gift? Thick skin. Yeah, thank you for a pig skin. We can make a backpack. Alright, whoever stole my Maxwell book, I'll give you a backpack if you can give me it. I will craft you a backpack if you can give me my book back. Can you please test if um, if you can block a dragonfly or beacon with a giant ball? I will later, aha. Work for the main, give me the book and I'll give you a backpack. Work for the main, I will give you a backpack. I will give you a backpack. It is not a scam. I am I am a very honest individual. Just drop the book and I'll give you a backpack. It's not hard to understand. Okay, look for the main. Come here. Look for the main. Thank you. Come here. Come here. Look for the main. Hold space. Yes. Why do I have two gaming books? I guess a spare one. Oh, we got a helmet. You know, let's make like backpacks. Three backpacks. Enjoy whoever gets them. I think the blueprint was a nightmare fuel blueprint. That doesn't. Wait, we can check what he got. I gave you a papyrus. Noob, where are you? Alright. Noob, you better hold space. Grab it. Did he. You didn't take it. You, you gotta hold space faster. One last chance. I'm running out of twigs. Take it. Alright, good. No more backpacks. <laughs> oh man, alright. Time to check what nightmare creatures give you. Um, Because that guy got a blueprint. He didn't use it. Like, what the hell? Wait, what? What are they called? Shadow creatures? Wait, what would they be called? A crawler? Why am I burning? Oh my god. I, someone set me on fire while I was looking at the thing. Uh, walking horror? Maybe that's what they're called here? No. Um, terror beak? 
Someone's dying near me. Where's the... Oh. Nightmare amulet and a purple gem. That guy either got a nightmare amulet or a purple gem blueprint. We have solved the mystery. Amazing. How long will the stream be? Probably for another hour or a bit. I could see Orange Man try to buy a $300 gaming book. Um, so now that we can, we have two Maxwell gaming books, which is unheard of, considering there should be only one in existence. But, wait, who gave me this battle helm? Because I can trade hats. I don't remember who gave me this battle helm. It was one of these Wickfords. Who gave me this battle helm? We gotta complete the deal. The hat trading deal, where are you? Oh, Wickford Main's dead. Huh. You know what? I don't know if it was you, but take this anyway. Take the hat. <laughs> okay. Anyways, let's not get distracted and let's build the base. We need minions. Someone gave me a hammer. A backpack blueprint, sure. Are you doing good m health and mental health wise? Yeah. Um, Alright, we have to build a base. We have to... I... I... I would like to make a... Rope... Rope blueprint! Whoever gave me that! Holy, that's actually really good. That is exactly what I wanted. Now. Thank you, Sir Scrotus. Now. We can either get... A wall blueprint from tumbleweeds or a hay wall blueprint from grass. I, all the grass is already picked so I think the optimal move here is to get tumbleweeds and hopefully get a wood wall. Purple gem blueprint. Oh that's the guy who killed the nightmare creature. Okay cool. I have another backpack blueprint so that's amazing. Here someone take this backpack blueprint. Three. Free epic stuff. We can get fences from this. Hmm. Uh, yeah, we j we're gonna just spam tumbleweeds. $19 DST card, and who wants it? And yes, I'm giving it away. Remember, starve, starve, starve. And trolls don't get smacked by a hundred spawn meteors. Well done. The Molkas. I'm new. Should I eat the green mushroom? The green mushroom um, lowers your sanity, but if you cook it, it raises your sanity. Also, there's some grass here. I see a tumbleweed. 0.7% chance to get a wood wall blueprint. How lucky do you think we are? Everyone in my BTD6 lobby, I'm going for overclock buffing. Isn't... Overclock is the engineer, right? Didn't they nerf him? I thought I thought that upgrade sucked now. Whatever. Let's, let's go back to... Get any walls for my base. Glad you're using my helmet, Orange. <laughs> it's... It's, um... We're trading hats. We have to... Okay, my voice is... Slightly starting to hurt. So I'm gonna just drink water. We got a rope. Okay, back to tumbleweed grinding. Um, zero point seven percent chance. So my maths could be wrong on this one, but I believe we have to pick like one hundred and twenty-five tumbleweeds if we want. Uh, Wood wall. That's 125 tumbleweeds. So we could be here for a while. Um, yeah. Does this give you anything? Doesn't look like it. <gasps> Wait! 2% chance if you chop these trees. Okay, that's what we're doing. 
Dude, screw tumbleweeds. That's like a t two and a half times greater chance of happening. Chop this, chop this. Yes, give me that wood wall blueprint. Let's go chop all the trees that are bad. Um, drinking vodka? I was not drinking vo vodka, unknown man. I'll have you know, I was drinking water. Water is an uh, amazing thing, actually. Uh, everything is kind of made out of water. So, anyways, let's... Let's try and get that wood wall blueprint. Because then we can build the greatest base ever. But I think a lot of people have had the same idea as me. So a lot of these trees seem to have been chopped already. Why are you sending mine diamonds in the chat? Why would you do that to yourself? I have the blueprint for wood walls? <gasps> Give me- who stole that? Who took my hard earned blueprint? Who stole my blueprint? You could get a drying rack if you pick these bushes. I like those odds. 1.5%? Someone robbed me of my wood wall. Why would you burn that? <laughs> Who else? Oh. Lantern and a wood wall. Okay, thank you. I'm gonna make a lantern. But most importantly, wood wall. Are caves enabled? Where's Slide and Beefalo? Uh, Sli he's a. Uh, he's he's um, Slide and Beefalo is um, he's he's, he's uh, he, uh, there. Boom. There you go. Enjoy. <laughs> he's very happy. So. How would we build- how- actually, you know what every good base needs? Flooring. I can't believe I didn't think of this earlier. If you want a good base, you need a... A wood floor. Wood turf. Whatever they're called. It's simple. So, a Wilson just died. I don't know what I, how I feel about that. Birch nut tree. Okay, birch nut tree. If we want flooring, wait, we need a pitchfork, don't we? So birch nut tree gives us. Rabbits give us pitchforks. Are you kidding me? Why am I burning? Whoa, up, 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 up. No, no, no. So if you want. If we want, um, if we want a pitchfork, we need to kill rabbits, I guess. And if we want a wood flooring blueprint, we have to kill those. Uh, we have to chop down those birch trees. But I think for now we should just try and make wood walls. I think that sounds like a plan. Let's even get a second logger. To join in. I dropped a Maxwell gaming book and immediately it got stolen. Luckily I have a spare one. Quick, quick, quick. And do the thing. Okay. Those fools. Oh, I hear hounds. See, if we had gotten the wood walls earlier, this wouldn't be a problem. The, the hounds would see the walls, they would bite the sharp tip of the wood wall and they would die. Wanna hear a joke? Sure. I'd like a joke, considering, um, I think we all need a joke some days in our lives. Please chop this tree, thank you. We have a lot of grass. How much walls do you think we can go for? Hmm. I gave you spare book. Thank you for the spare book call, me logic. You could actually help me out. Colby Logic is just carrying us all. He He's the one who got the backpack blueprint. Why are you giving me nightmare fuel? Who's burning my trees? Oh. 
Nice. Thank you for extinguishing that, goddammit, hounds. You know what? Hounds will take care of themselves. If I don't believe they, they, that they exist, then they don't exist. That's how that works. Yes, Weber, chop. Uh oh. Maybe he does ex. Why did the auto target target the nightmare creature? That's, uh. That's a very stupid thing that just happened. Let's go, Dead Maxwell, man. Colby Logic, let's go. Where did you come from? I just. I just watched the grass regrow in front of my eyes. It was. The most beautiful sight I have ever seen. Orange, I want to trade. What do you want to trade? Hello, my man. What is your offer? I want my garland back. Oh, here's. I have a problem. I gave the garland to someone, so I don't know who has it anymore. For winter hat. Oh, yeah, I don't have the hat. <laughs> What is like the top tier hat in this game? Are you going to go to, to sprint? That's way too long. Imagine playing Don't Starve for like six hours. That would die of gaming overdose, man. Akua has so much stuff. He went to the ruins. Wait, actually, if you go to the ruins, I think you can like craft random blueprints and kind of gamble. Which could be interesting. Potentially. Oh, I am starving, aren't I? That's... We'll think of that... We'll, we'll solve that problem when we get to it. Oh, thanks for the winner hat. Now we have... Now our hack game has just stepped up even more. We are becoming cooler and cooler. Please tell me the joke demo, because I would like to hear it. Why don't you just build an alchemy? That's true. Uh, do, do, do you, little man, lol. I should just build an alchemy engine. I am... I am, uh... Not smart man, hello Wilson. Oh, they planted plants. Let's talk to the plant. You know, I once ruled this entire world once, now I'm talking to a plant. Amazing. Alright. Let's defend this base so the hounds will never kill us. This is a strategy that all the greatest DST players will tell you. They will always, if you ask any do don't starve player, they will always say, you need to build walls, because walls are the superior strategy. They are not a wa waste of resources. They are a extreme good use of your resources. You should always make them given the chance. Never turn down an opportunity to build walls. So, let, let's just do that. Um, can you get out of the way? I'm trying to build a base here. Thank you. Oh yeah, I forgot, you can open presents at the fire pit. Alchemist boosts, amazing. Um, why is it, why is everyone insane? You no, know, one thing I noticed with like, extreme, and I mean extreme high player counts and don't starve, is that the more players you have, the more insane people are. And I'm wondering why that is, because it's not that hard to stay sane, but, and yet, whenever there's a server going on, it always seems like everyone is insane, which is kind of weird, I don't know. Someone just died. You know what I also just realized? We need um, gates. We need gates, so we can build a door to our magnificent base. What's it take to make a gate these days? Birch nut tree, oh. Wood gate and wood flooring are both gotten from birch nut trees, alright then. I'm gonna have to chop a lot of birch nut trees then. Um, let's continue. What? I hate these horrors, man. They, they're blocking me. I can't fit. I can make gates? Oh, that's really good. Um, do you need, do you need rope? I can give you rope if you need it. Here, t Crimson Dragon, take this rope and make gates with it. Oh, yeah, okay. We're trying to make 
the greatest base. Oh, thank you for the... Oh my god, these are so good kits. What is this? We are making the most sophisticated base in existence. Um, stop. Get out of the way, Wilson. It's a big wobby spawn. Oh my god, but I didn't know base building was so difficult. People keep running over you. Oh, look at this skate skin. That's... It looks so good. What the hell? It's a literal garden gate. I love it. Alright. And now we repair these two walls. It's a, it's a special building technique. To repair the two walls beside the gate. And it looks 0.1% more attractive. If I can get her... What did you give me? Purple gem blueprint. Amazing. Let's put that in the chest. I... Let's go here, because people aren't over here. So it might be slightly easier to build stuff. Oh my god, get out of the way. <laughs> ah! Oh, this is... I would rather be dead. Who placed the hay wall? Okay. Fine, I guess half our base is just hay walls. Okay, cool. Let's go get some birch nut trees. I'm starving. Let's eat a mandrake because it's it's not a pr just it's a, eating a mandrake is about as much of a pro strategy as building walls around your base. Base is on fire. The base. I. I leave you guys for a single goddamn second. <laughs> that fence is made out of iron or something. How the hell is it burning? No! My base, my chest. Fire, fire. Oh no. It, it, it takes... It's gonna take the space, like, faster to burn down. Then it takes for that took for me to build it. It's not even worth it, man. They just burned down my base. They destroyed my entire livelihood. How is their moon shards? Wall's pretty good, am I right? They found my wood weakness. Fire. Well, you know what? They can't burn flooring, so let's go do that. I gotta get some wood flooring, and to get wood flooring, wait, we can get a think tank? Is that how you make boats? Huh, okay, I guess we'll maybe try and make that. I'll take two number nines, two no number nine large, number six with extra drip, two number sevens, yes. Um... What if your base could freeze instead of burn? So like... It just gets- your base gets snowed in, or like... Just gets turned into ice? I mean, the thing about freezing is it doesn't exactly... Spread. Is there really an opposite to fire? I guess like water, maybe. So maybe your base burning down is the equivalent to it getting flooded and shipwrecked. You guys are still legends because most of you resist resisted to leave. Who's better, Chester, Chester or Hutch? Chester because um, he gives you a backpack blueprint if you kill him. So therefore he is the superior man. Let's get in the wormhole, thank you, okay. Oh, this goes here. Um, the swamp is over here. We are on the wrong side of the map. We are on the very wrong side of the map. We are nowhere near where we should be. Opposite the fire is Orange's birthday. Uh, yeah, yeah, thank you for bringing up that. Uh, it definitely exists. I, I love it when it's my birthday except it's not because it's not my birthday the bulk has why dude so 
You get pocket of poop if you kill skeletons. That means if you just spam dying and reviving, you can get a bucket of poop. That's that's a that's crazy. Hmm. Shipwrecked get the mechanics gonna come back? Probably not. I mean, flooding is like the most annoying thing next to your base burning down because it's summer. Let's be honest. I I don't think anyone wants their base to be flooded because they're. They based near a river or something stupid like that. Orange Wobby is yours now? I don't think you get how that works. I refuse to admit the fact that spiky trees are are useful. Well. Actually, in this mod, they give you a wooden wall and a boomerang. Which I would say is pretty useful. I have an empty watering can blueprint. Amazing. Dragon eggs are worse than floods if they hatch. Is lava wet? Before I answer that question, I have to drink water. So, is lava wet? Um, we gotta answer what lava, what wetness is. What does it mean? To be wet, and I and I have the answer. To be wet means that you have a wetness meter and don't starve. That is above zero. And last time I checked, lava in this game, the magma pools, cannot become wet, or can they? Wait, is it possible to have wet magma pools? We need ice flingo to prevent base fire. Huh. Wait, is it possible to... Is it possible to have magma pools that are wet from raining? Wait, where's the ice flingo magic? Mini glacier? I'm not mining mini glaciers to get an ice flingo magic. I'm not insane. Noob gamer, stop pushing me, man. Why do you... Make me- I'm gonna starve. I did- eat monster meat. I skipped. Yes. Okay, wait, it's possible- It is possible to see wet magma pools then. Okay, I guess lava is wet then. Because if it's wet, then that means its wetness meter is above zero. So lava is wet. Hmm. And because ponds are always wet as well, that means water is also wet. We have just did science and don't starve. We have proven some things. Now, let's go chop birch nut trees for a blueprint. Is water wet? Yes, because if we look at this pond over here, well, if it was raining, it would be a wet pond. And the ponds are made out of water, so um, if the pond made out of water is wet, then that means that the water in the pond is in fact wet. Alright. I was killed by a Terabeek? Was I insane? I might have been insane, don't worry, is it touchstone? Up there. What's that blueprint? Fishing rod, amazing. Is orange wet? So. Oranges? Do you mean the color or the fruit? We have to be more specific here. When you ask, are oranges wet? Okay, boulders give you... Cut stone. Where's the- here's the touchstone. Wait, this touchstone is like a zero zero almost. That's amazing. Okay, now let's go get back my stuff that totally isn't stolen right now. Wix is gonna die. That what the hell did this man have on him? Look at these gears. 
gear, gear, gears, 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 gears. Cowboy hat, cowboy hat, cowboy hat. This man went to the ruins. Carl, how did you get this stuff? I'm sorry, Carl. He had my gnome. I'm not sorry, Carl. You robbed me of my most precious item, my gnome. It was of high value to me. I got achievement for beating 10 hard co-op games. Wait, you won co-op? Oh man, I wanna play BTD6 now. I don't wanna grind for blueprints. Oh wait, people are giving me my stuff back. This is amazing. We're advancing, they don't wanna kill me anymore. I didn't mean oranges, you are orange. Can you be wet? Can I be wet? Well, there's a problem. When, last time it rained and I went outside, I looked in the top right of my vision and I didn't see a wetness meter. So that means I am not wet. Also, I lost my gaming book again. Oh, never mind because... Jhuriam99 saved us in the most last second moment. Well, thank you for that, I guess. I need nightmare fuel, I hate my life. <laughs> Orange man, take me by the hand. Yeah. The question is about the fruit. Well, the problem with oranges is that we can't confirm if they are wet or not because oranges currently do not exist in Don't Starve, so they could be wet, but we just don't know it. As for the color orange, there's a lot of things in this game that are orange, and they can also... Um, and like see this birch nut tree, this birch nut tree can be is orange and it can also be wet so therefore I think the color orange is actually wet. The fruit orange could be wet or could not be wet, it's undetermined. And then I am not wet. I hope that answers the very deep question of is orange wet. So if we chop enough of these trees we can get a gate or a... Uh, floor blueprint. Glomer. If you kill him, it's only a 10% chance, that's so garbage. Is that a pet? That's a pet. Are fruits moist? It's not the same as wet. I, maybe I am made of water, but does that make me wet? Does being made of water make you wet? Oh, I got my ashes from the last time I died. That's amazing. Um, I just realized we need a pitchfork. Because, like, if we get the wood turf blueprints, there's no point to it if we don't have a pitchfork, so... Rabbit. Oh, I forgot we have to kill rabbits. Oh, that's gonna be such a pain. Who got... Who got an endothermic fire pit? Why are basic fruits not in DST like apples and oranges? Um, I don't think there's a need for apples and oranges. They're not basic fruits either. I mean, apples probably are, but oranges aren't really. Like, and, uh... Oranges like are a typical household fruit, but I wouldn't say they're like a typical fruit you would see everywhere. How did Krampus spawn? Who killed? We can get a 5% chance for two of the most useless items. Hell yeah, guys. And a random blueprint. Why did you set him on fire? Get him. Get the bad Santa Claus. He, oh, his stuff burned. Well done, guys. We set him on fire because we are geniuses. 
Oh no, look at these crawling horrors. That's, that's a... Uh... Yeah. Who should I use, Maxwell or Rickford? Use Maxwell because he's game and get wood gate. Oh, that's a wood gate. That's not a wood wall. A uh, wood floor. False alarm. Found toads. Did we kill toads too? Wait, do... Do we kill toads too? Do we kill toads too? We might kill toads too. Stop giving me crap. I'm not your public storage system. Yes. Should we... T should we take Florin? I mean, should we kill Toadstool? Question for the ages. I don't want glomeroids. Please leave me alone, man. I'm not a trash can, I promise. Stop giving me stuff. Oh, man. Sometimes getting free stuff is too much. Wood gate blueprint. God damn it. We meet at the Bee Queen Torchstone. Okay. Screw grinding for a wood gate. I mean, a wood floor. Let's go kill Toadstool. You know, I'm gonna build a gate at Toadstool just to show him who's the boss. Just to show him I'm not messing around. If anyone ever builds a gate near you, uh, it's a sign of a it's a it's a, it's a threat. Don't kill toads. Still kill misery toads. Still, we have to get like a bird. No one wants to get a bird. Let's just go kill misery toads. Still, meet at the bee queen touchstone, which is uh there. That's where it is. It's around there. Hello, orange. We. Meet at the Bee Queen Touchstone, and then the guy will lead us to a uh, Toadstool. And we can kill him, because Toadstool is the easiest boss. He has like 5 health. Something like that. Maybe 6 health if, we, if he's lucky. It's not that much. He, he, did we, there's no way we die to Toadstool. Imagine dying to Toadstool. Um... Now I think about it, we don't have any grass. We do have grass, never mind. Oh, hi, Wula. Ah! Take my cowboy hat. Stop giving me garbage! Where is Hades, or whatever his name is? Slime the slime, I hate you, I despise you. Let's give this to someone who won't give it back. Let's sneakily give these items to people, and they'll never know who gave it to them. Let's hope this won't be the nothing world. Why won't you? Why do you want to hope it's not the what nothing world? If it's like the nothing world, then we'll kill Toadstool. Yeah, Toadstool is easy. Listen to the guy in chat. Toadstool is super easy. The person who gave me the battle helmet is back. Now, where is the man who told us to meet here? Where? Ah, here he is. Hades. Um, is this enough people to kill souls? Still, probably. Oh, oh, follow the Wigfred. Why you don't take my present? Slime the slime. I don't want globberweeds, okay? I, I don't want them. Let's go, man. <laughs> Into the caves. I'm gonna kill Toadstool. Wait, what does Toadstool even give you in this mod? Hmm. If you kill Toadstool, you get a... Oh my god, check this out. If you kill Toadstool, you get a pan flute blueprint, as well as three random recipes. He's not too bad. Why did my game crash? Did anyone else's game crash? Did... That might have been just me. 
<laughs> oh no. My game somehow crashed. Wait, if, was that just me that crashed? I think the server might still be up. Mine crashed too? Hmm. If it's just me, then that, that's a problem. Aku hasn't said anything. Ripped the game and oh, crashed full. Okay, looks like it did crash. F in the chat. Yeah, that's right. The game actually crashed. <laughs> Let's search orange serve. Oh. <laughs> it didn't actually crash. Oh, uh, I just joined my own server. It was 37 out of 40. I guess I just crashed. Oh, I just joined really easily. I am clearly some kind of god if everyone else is struggling to join. <laughs> I, th I thought it was a bug. The server's still up. I was the only one that crashed for some reason. Hello, first person Maxwell. Alright, we're back. Orange Daddy, I'm here. Don't call me that. <clears throat> <gasps> Wooden floor and blueprint! Let's go. We got the blueprint. Thank you whoever gave me that. Oh, this is great. Now we just have to kill a few rabbits. We got back somehow. Where is the head man? The Wigfred. Or did he ditch us? Where's Wigfred? I'll follow a coup, I trust him. Wait, I can make a lantern. I can make a lantern. I'm making a lantern. Lantern! Someone gave me this blueprint ages ago and now I can use it. If I get some more... Um, oranges in my mom... It, Thanks for that. I really appreciate the, the you, you could have you could have said any like sentence with any word you can you could have wanted. And you chose to say that. Also, why do we just go to a dead end? I thought you guys knew where you were going. This is a bad situation. This is not a good situation to be in. Hmm. Did you ever wonder if he's using voice changer? Oh my god, guys. I think this man, who can barely operate, don't starve, actually figured out how to use a voice changer. Oh my god, that's so smart. I, I clearly use a voice changer. Um, where's Toadstool or does no one here know? Are we- are we all kinda stupid? <laughs> Did the guy we- whoa! Oh, I didn't press tab. With the update, all these heads look so weird, they're moving and floating up and down. Oh, I don't like that, it looks so off. They're so small as well, they used to be bigger. Why did you change this? Oh man. Oh, they're fighting Toadstool without me, that's cool. Um, let's go. If he blows the green stuff on you, get away because that's pretty bad. I'm- I might starve during this fight, but that's fine. Starving is just the uh, inevitability and it's not something you can necessarily stop. Why is there flint falling from the sky? That man died to flint. Uh, 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 beep, 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 beep. What is going on? I lost so much health. Glomer Gloop. I'm insane now. That was actually a terrible idea. Hit. Hit. And mine. 
Wait, Maxwell man, where's my Maxwell guys? Mine these trees. Or chop them, whatever, just get rid of them. Chop the trees where he gets garbage damage reduction. I'm insane now, aren't I? Yep, he wants to murder me. That is amazing. Oh no. Why is my life pain? You know, insanity is like one of the worst things to have in this game. It's not fun. Where I should drop my lantern. Drop, okay. Now we have a per- oh, we just placed the campfire in the same spot where I dropped my lantern. We gotta kill this guy to get our sanity back. Oh, thank you for the food. Although Toadstool's gonna... Like, make it vanish, but still, thanks for the food. Now at least we won't starve. And he's making trees again. Don't burn the trees, because then he spawns the thing. Make this. Alright, chop the tree shadow logger. We can do this. We want Wilson cam? No you don't. Oh man. He put the green stuff on me. How to deal with green stuff. Walk away and you'll be fine. Oh my god, dog. Uh-oh, we might have dropped it in a very... That barking is actually an intimidation tactic. Now Toadstool is intimidated. Look at him, he's uh, making spore caps, which my guys can chop. And while he chops trees, I can... Uh, Kill Toadstool, this is... Toadstool is ridiculously hard, honestly. He's just... Unkillable. There's no recorded footage of anyone killing Toadstool. Trust me, guys. I, I checked. Alright. We will kill Toadstool. Stop dying. This, 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 this is a... Uh, easy game. How do you die? It's not... Physically possible. I'm not putting my dog down. <laughs> Why would you say that? Ironically enough, people dying is really good for me, because the more people that die... Those are people that drop their lanterns, so... That gives us light. Unfortunately though, the more people that are dead... The faster my sanity drains, which means the more nightmare creatures spawn, which means the less fun I have, because this is annoying. Let's place down wooden gates. Intimidation tactic. Known to work in history. Every single time. Alright, I have to kill these shadow creatures one way or another. Um, there's so much of them. Why? Oh man, I... When there's a bunch of people that don't starve server... The, the amount of, like, sandy creatures that spawn is kind of stupid. It's It, like, scales for every prep player, and... Um... Look at this! That is so much! I think... Are they all after me? Hmm. What? There's more, like, nightmare creatures than there is of a... We're not fighting Toadstool, we're fighting the... Shadow crawlers. Man. We're not we're not gonna die to Toadstool, we're gonna die to a sandy drain. Well, we're dead. Who's left alive? There's a few Wigfrids that are like all insane. Wilson is lurking in your DMs. Wooden gates against Toadstool? Oh, he broke the wooden gates. I guess he's the real Giga chat, and Maxwell Mobile Gaming is dead, yeah. Why? Oh my god. How did we die? Here lies Orange. Everyone is- everyone else is insane. And um, Toadstool hasn't even started stomping. Oh, now he has. 
So Toadstool is now, I believe, below 50% health. Which doesn't mean much, considering this man is like 25,000 health. We could still do it. It's gonna be a pain. This is a repeat of nothing. Nah, this is a repeat of nothing world times 4. Without lag. What is your highest round on BTD6? I can check for you actually. It's, let's... No, who cares about Don't Starve? Everyone knows BTD6 is the superior game. Ugh. Let's just open BTD6 in the background. Died to the easiest boss. <laughs> well, technically, I died to Shadow Creatures, which is arguably worse. But I didn't die to Toadstool. Alright, my highest round in BTD6 is... 271. Amazing. Truly the greatest game. Oh. Did you ever fight Toadstool in solo? I, t I feel like when I fight Toadstool by myself, I'm a bit more prepared than a axe and a whip for the helmet. <laughs> um, who's still alive? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. There's a few people, but I'm not sure if they're all down here. Does anyone else think these heads are weird? Like, I don't like how they bob up and down. They're also, like, smaller. Wormwood goes out of his portrait frame, and he just died. It just looks so off to me. I can't believe you died to something you've killed twice at once. Twice at once. Who's alive? We have Willow, we have Crimson Dragon, we have Jaiku Sumutin, we have Aku, we have Slime the Slime, Hades, Crimson Dragon just died, and we have Robin Flock. That's roughly six people left. They do look like they have some good gear though, but they're also all insane. So I'm not sure if they can actually kill him. I, do you think they can kill Toadstool? He's 20,000 health at least. Can you open map? Oh. Uh, the cave entrance we went through is like... Near... I don't even remember what it's near. <laughs> I hope this helps you. The portal is there. I'm not sure if it does. Poor Maxwell Gabe, he couldn't defeat the mighty frogman. Hmm. I still, th I still think the amount of shadow creatures is a bit insane. Especially with the amount of people who are dead. With, like, the amount of people that are dead. I, well, I don't know why ghosts, um, affect how much nightmare creatures spawn. But I guess they do. You know, Don't Starve isn't really optimized to be played with 40 people, so that probably explains a lot. Like, right when you spawn in, half your stuff gets robbed. There's like no grass or twigs with 40 player servers. But you know, we're gonna kill Toadstool. Without, without powerful weapons, but with a powerful number of people. No Wilson Cam. Wilson Cam sucks. Maxwell phone gaming is better. No, oh man, this is so horrible for them. Look at the amount of creatures. There's like three of them. He just spawned in trees, which they have to chop down. Like, all of them. Otherwise, he has insane damage reduction. And past all these nightmare creatures and these trees that he's probably gonna spawn back. They have to somehow kill him. With, when he has, like, health of Bee Queen right now. If you can defeat the mighty Frogman, can you defeat the mighty Purple Zeppelin? The Purple Zeppelin, you say? Hold on, let's... Let's open up the good game. 
<laughs> oh no. Let's let's kill the purple blimp. Hell yeah. Sc screw that garbage don't starve game. No one plays that game. Uh I hear Toad's still stomping. It's going like like I don't know. An easy map. We can't die on. Did I miss the 3D building stream? Oh no, we're just playing with a... Uh... Which... Toadstool. Find your blueprints mod. No science machine. Science is disabled. We do have a... But yet to get blueprints, you have to... You have to get blueprints instead of science machine. And you get... Um, blueprints from random stuff. Anyways, while they while they suffer killing Toadstool, I'm gonna have I'm have lots of fun playing the greatest game known to mankind. Why isn't okay? I heard Wickford die. That's probably a good sign. The greatest strategy. Did you know that iconic stone heads protruding from the ground on Easter Island are so what? Alright, so the greatest strategy in this game is to not play anything. This dart monkey is free. He didn't cost me anything. We will just build farms and start the greatest economy while other people suffer. Wait, is everyone dead? Hold on a second. Are you all dead? Oh no, at least one Wigfred's alive. He's probably gonna die though. It's just a coup. I think Toadstool even left. Yeah, Toadstool left. Are you cringe? Yes. Alright, back to balloon game. Let's just build a farm. We're not afraid of losing lives. This man can probably be placed in a better spot, but it's too late now. We can't... We can't really sell him because he's zero dollars. Oh yeah, I named him that. That's amazing. <laughs> this is not DST. This is Don't Star. This is the new update. Is everyone dead? Oh, everyone's dead. You guys died to Toadstool. I can't believe this happened. How did you die to Toadstool? Man, where are the monkeys, orange man? Well, we have... We have one monkey, he's doing fine. We have 94 lives, we can't die. We just build farms. We make money, and we win. Well, everyone else is dead on the server. Blue Tower Defense 6, yes. Screenshot, huh? Look at this first screenshot. Alright, uh, we might play a second Dark Monkey. Just, just $200 down the drain, that's a lot of money. I just spent $200? This is Don't Starve or Split Monkeys are good and useful. Yeah, I mean, Splo Monkeys aren't the worst thing. If you kill them during the nightmare cycle, you get like food, nightmare fuel, and good stuff. But now we have bananas. Lots of bananas. Why do I hear Wigfred hurting sounds? How are... <laughs> I'm checking back to the Don't Starve thing, it seems people... Wait, do you dare to play co-op on a short expert map? Actually, why don't I play co-op? You're right. Let's go play the laggiest game on an expert map. Four people.
if anyone has this game, we're gonna be playing the hard one of the hardest maps, the hardest difficulty with one life. This can't go horribly wrong at all. Well, everyone else is every, what? What are these people doing? Look at them, they're just sitting here. They're just sitting here dead. This is just peak ghost gang. They don't want to do- I'm not sure what they're doing. Who is next, Orange? What is next, Orange? I don't know, I'm just playing balloon game. Oh! Holy shit! We have people, let's go! <laughs> the monkey game. Let's go beat the hardest map. <laughs> oh no. So there's like four paths. They all lead to here. If one balloon gets by, we kinda die. Also there's this funny emote. Yeah, amazing. There's an adventure mode mod for DST. So where do we begin? You placed a sniper uh no uh, boop, boop. That's why why did you fast forward? This is uh, no. Okay, let's go again. <laughs> Wait, submarine. We can start with submarine. No. Player f Player 2 and player 4 just gave me all their money. Well, that's actually a lot of money. Yep, we're playing something else than Don't Starve while everyone else is uh Now we're beating. Can I change the title somehow? Re reject humanity, return to Spill Monkey. Yes. Who placed the glue gunner there? Wait, maybe the glue gunner strategy is the key to victory. Hmm. Good. Good plan. All right. More submarines. They are like the most cost-efficient tower. This glue monkey is slowing down the blue. This is he's he's carrying us. Thank you. Player tree. Oh, money. I guess... I guess they just don't wanna... They don't wanna spend money, so they just give it to me. You know what? I'm happy with that exchange. We can't die now. Creative random spawn or pick up anything. Why is Orange playing balloons? Um, we were playing... We were playing on a, a server, but it went like this. So now we're gaming here. With four, three people. Actually, this server is still open. With a mod. What is going on over there? You know, this is the reason. We don't listen to whatever's happening there. Let me... Look at the death count. Let me turn off... Uh, sound. Okay. <laughs> Alright, common popping balloon sounds now. What is happening? I just looked at the stream and it's not DST. Also, I d minecraft the school and cannot attend this DST thing. This is Blood's Tower Defense 6, the greatest tower defense game in existence. I'm not sure how we're not dead. I like the submarine. I'm not sure how we're not dead. Okay, uh, we might die next round. Submarine! Yes. Or we might survive next round with submarine army. This is the real stream. He's played shipwrecked mod, can't you guys see? Yeah, I'm using the monkey character, we're gonna die. How is- okay. This game is like, actually a horror game. My heart doesn't get as pumped to when I- Like when the balloons reach like here. It gets so stressful. It's it's like so str I don't know. I've never you don't experience a stress as high as like being on a high round and the balloons get into like here and they're like barely get popped. You could just leave the server. This the DST server is still open if anyone wants to join it. What are they doing in here? 
What is that? <laughs> oh, let's not focus on that. Okay. My plan is to get advanced intel. Now he can shoot in the range of other towers. So he can shoot over here. Um. Crap. Okay. We need a better strategy. Some submarine was definitely the strat. Four player. <laughs> Four player chimps mode. Did they give me all their money? Oh, <laughs> everyone's putting down submarines. Um, let's give player three all our cash and just see what he does with it. Will he upgrade his submarine? Very curious. Thanks. Okay. Hello, we are uh, playing Don't Starve, definitely. Oh, he bought double guns. That's pretty good. <laughs> Submarine is the strat. We will win this map. It's only 100 rounds. Toad's tool had 52,000 health. And this is only 100 rounds. I, I looked at the DST server and they're doing some very good things there. Um, I think... Maybe I should just give player 3 all my money. So he can get a stronger submarine than what I can get. We need wealth. Wait, you gave me cash? Yeah, I gave you cash. We need money to survive. We need, uh... No, take all my cash. We... It's smarter to just upgrade a submarine than to spam unupgraded ones, I think. Oh, look at this defense. They do not even touch the bridge. Look at this. We are powering through. Last time we died to round 15. Why do you keep giving me all your money? Because I want you to use it. We need to buy airburst darts. It splits into three darts on impact. That is really good. We just need to... Wait. Everyone give player three all your money. And you can buy airburst darts, I think. If I added that up correctly. Alright, next round is the round we died to last time. The mod is already broken? Um, no, the mod worked fine actually. But, we, I feel like we did everything we wanted to. It was fun, now we're playing balloon game. The server is still open if you want to join and we destroyed this round, nice. Yeah, the server is still open, they're doing something in the caves. Um... It's in the pinned comment. The problem with submarine later on is that they don't have enough popping power and bullet speed to get the pink balloons. What do you mean? We killed the pink balloons. We're doing it. We have, we have airburst starts. Okay, advanced intel is next. By advanced intel, I'll buy like a glue gunner for range. Yes! Now you can see in this glue gunner's range. Perfect. Uh, maybe I'll get a ninja for camo. For camo detection. Oh, actually, uh, we need someone place down a ninja. Is a camo blue? The ninja guys, no. God damn it, man! We lost to the easiest round. <laughs> With what blueprint do you unlock the monkey sub? Uh. You have to kill Crab King because he's like a water thing. And it's a 1% chance that every time you kill Crab King, you'll get a monkey sub blueprint. That was really satisfying. Metal balloons? Yeah, we would have died to metal balloons as well. Um, why is. Player 4 and 2 AFK. <laughs> they almost got to the edge and my heartbeat quadrupled. I don't like that. I wanna... I don't like short maps, but I picked this one anyway. Because it's funny when we die. Check DST. 
What's happening? Why is there depth worms and spill monkeys? Okay. Holy crap. What are these guys up to? See, would you rather watch this hell? Or this nice relaxing monkey game? Not pick your poison. I think player 3 is going for the air burst sub. Oh, we have a wizard. That might be useful. He gives the range to the submarine. He can pop lead balloons and we can give him camo as well. Uh, I think I want to give player 3 money though. You should play Minecraft. <laughs> I come back to the stream and he's playing this. Hey, come on, would you rather watch this? What is he- what even is this? Or... <laughs> yeah, would you rather watch this or this? Oh, we might- I hate my life. I... Maybe Don't Starve is secretly the better g Holy, that lag. Look, what is that? What, why is Aku killing his own server? Let's go back here. It's connected because it will- Oh my god. Like a man? This is the hardest game. Alright. We have yet to make it past round 23. This is basically the peak of gaming. This is the hardest thing in existence. Play Terraria Master? No. Okay, we're going for the st same strategy. That's amazing. My game crashed? Everything died? Oh, nice. The server ended. Um. Hmm, I wonder if he's gonna re-enable it. Ooh, a ninja monkey, that's really good. Now we won't die to the camel balloon. At least I hope. Um, let's give yellow all our money again. Player 3, buy double guns, or whatever it's called. Server crashed. Alright, he crashed his own server, what a mad lad. Oh, that was close. We gotta upgrade our sub, man. I gave you money. Robobin left us. No, I gave him all my money. Oh no. I gave all my money to an AFK guy. We might die now. This is really bad. He has $700. You know what I could do with that cash? Don't forget camo detection, we have a ninja this time. Why are you requesting money? You have, you have all the money. Alright, I'm not giving money to any, any whatever. I don't trust their financial crime. I give them money, they don't spend it, and we die. What is going on right now? Hmm. I think we can try airplanes mod, okay. That sounds fun, if you have the... If you make the server, I can give people the password. And whatever. The airplane mod is pretty cool. You like fly around in the like semi first person thing and you go up as well. Could really use it with the y axis. Maybe make some interesting stuff. I come back to this, yeah. Woof, no. <laughs> it's a good dog, it's an intimidation tactic against the balloons. According to all known of laws of physics, the rook should not be able to charge. 
Its body is too big for its tiny legs to be able to charge. Thank you for giving me money. Come on, like five more dollars for double damage. Alright, let's go. Now 1080. For the next milestone, we need a dog reveal? No, no dog reveal. Is your dog the one that's barking outside of my house? What are the odds? Hmm. Interesting. Okay. We need more submarines. I'm sorry to tell you, I don't think this wizard or this ninja is quite as well, is quite, is quite as good at, at defending the early rounds as much as the submarines. The submarines, the darts will follow the balloons. Which is pretty good. That was close. Make an equipable Wilson server. That sounds like the greatest idea ever. If I request cash, what's gonna happen? Uh-oh, this is a hard round. There's pink balloons, but we're fine. We survived. Oh, he gave me money. Alright, thank you. We just have to survive. Oh yes, money. We're getting money. Um... We're so close. 20 more dollars, come on. No, don't die. Ah. Oh. <laughs> this is what happens when we don't spam submarines. We die. Oh, I just got all the money from player two. That's nice. This is the best stream I've ever been to, I agree. Put a min mini gunner over the gate. A darling gun on here. I wonder if that works. I might try that. He's a thousand dollars, so I have to buy him later, but that might work. It's a straight line, and if I put him up here, that's really good. I DM you, Orange? Oh, thank you. Okay. If you want to join a Koos server, he has one called... Uh, name... It's called Airplane or something? Airplane's a coup and the password is testing. Yeah, you can join that Don't Stop server now. We were streaming, um, Don't Starve, the mod was pretty good actually, but we did, we killed Beakweed in Dragonfly, then we got the Toad's Tool and everyone died, so now we're here. And we're gonna beat Balloon Game while consistently dying over and over again, I'm not sure. Ooh, we have a lot of money. What if we just remove the trees for a thousand dollars, instead of actually Buying any useful upgrades. Look at the power of this submarine. Thank you for the money. Look at this boomer doing nothing. Yes, airburst darts. What if an equipable willow did fire damage and equipable wicks did electric damage? That sounds like a fun mod if anyone makes equipable characters. What the hell? I don't have the stop symbol. I have this though. And this. <laughs> Why can't you just play the stock siren sound? That's amazing. Remember when I said you will become official BTD6 YouTuber? We almost died there. What did I tell you about read and killing people? Equipable Wilbur. Yeah, if you hit a pig with, with Equipable Wilbur, they turn into a were, were pig. Ninja. Okay, if we get advanced intel, 
He can hit into the ninja's range and hit the camo balloon. This is good. And we have the boomerang and the ninja for extra range. That's that's actually really good. Just please let me buy the upgrade. Alright. He can see in all the tower's ranges. And we have another sub. The next thing we need... <laughs> Why you played BTD? We know that the chat in BTD 6 be of annoying loud sounds. Yeah, for some reason we can... Uh, I don't know why, why the game lets you do this. Can we update the thing? We can't upgrade the description, that's sad. I just confuse people. Yeah. I want to get Glaive Ricochet? We might do that, but first, uh, let's come next round. Let's come next round. Someone burn Alchemist. No, slow down. Burn Alchemist. Give me money. Burn Alchemist fast or we die. Why would you fast forward? No. <laughs> Here we go again. He's playing the secret level in DST. Well, he gave me all the money. All right, next time, we need a ninja, and after the ninja, we need um, an alchemist, this guy, to pop the leads. Otherwise, we just die, because nothing can kill them. Is there a BTD mod for DST? I don't think so. I'm not sure how that would work. I guess you use, like, eye turrets or something? Maxwell stopped gaming. <gasps> Wait, where did Maxwell Gaming go? He's under the balloons. There we go, he's back. Uh, he's kind of covering a few stuff. Let's flip him. There we go. Now he's now he's only the gaming has only just begun. He's on he's playing balloons on his phone. I'm <laughs> yeah, this is the secret level of Don't Starve. I don't know what to tell you. Because I don't have any useful heroes. We have, a, we have a big monkey and a yellow monkey. That's great. Shoot the blow darts at West Balloons? That could work, but how would the West Balloons move? I guess you could mod them to move. That actually sounds fun. There is blow darts in Don't Starve. And there's different types of blow darts. They're kind of like upgrades. Why can't we have Wix gaming? Because Wix... Um, I'm sorry to tell you this, but he's just not a gamer. Guys, we need more popping stuff. I, we, we need submarines or we die. It's simple. This is what unlocks after you beat Fuel Weaver. Yeah, when you open the portal and you wait there long enough, um, you're met with this screen. Oh. Okay, I guess we somehow survived that. Who keeps placing this wizard? It never works. I broke a coup server? The plane server is crashing. Really? Is the plane mod just like bad or... Well, not bad. Can you crash the game with the plane mod? How does that work? Is there like a way you can crash the game with the plane mod? Because it does mess with... Um, the y-axis and a few other stuff, but I don't think it's like that bad. Server crashed. Someone set planes on fire. Setting the planes on fire makes the server crash. That's a very odd bug. You know what game wouldn't crash? This game. If you have, if you buy a fire wizard, the game won't crash. So that's why it's an amazing game. <laughs> Yeah, 
The plane crashed so hard they crashed the server. Wow. Are you guys playing like Microsoft Flight Simulator over there? How much planes have you built? Wait, we can build planes as well. Holy, oh my god, we can make planes. Plane monkey. That's the answer to winning. $865. Plane monkey. Okay, I'm done with server today. Alright. Bye, Aku. I guess. Damn it. <laughs> I will beat this. <laughs> Eventually we will. Reject everything, return to crossbow. Attack shooter, huh? That's an interesting strategy. Let's find some monkey mods. No. This is the monkey mod. Okay, Akua stopped with the server, that's fine. Yeah. Yes, reject old sword, return to monkey pop in blue. There we go, let's pin that. Maybe you can host the BT6 modded server? How does that work? How does a modded server for this game work? I I've seen a few crazy mods in this game actually. There's one that lets you change perspective and like move how you see. And you can see weird stuff like what's behind this castle. The, the game looks really strange. I'm not sure how much mods there is for this game, and they're pretty hard to get. Change the stream title. What made them make six of these games? I don't think I can change the stream title, which is kind of unfortunate, but um, whatever. It'll be fine. Not spam the beat, st spam the stream chat with BTD six codes. That that's what we need. We need everyone to play this map in chimps mode. Why are people rejecting the monkey submarine strategy? Th guys, this is the thing that carried us and now we're dead. Man. Pengineer is S tier in chimps. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna move the boomerang there. How did we survive that? It was fun helping in Blueprint server. Yeah, thank you for that. It was actually pretty nice. Yes, the submarine strategy. They have returned to it. The best strategy. It literally never fails. If you just use submarines, you can't die. The most cost-effective tower. Where do I join our player? Uh... We... We... We started that game a bit ago with four people and I guess we're just playing... I saw an account on Instagram called Don't Starve New Home where it's like a Don't Starve fan game but looks like Don't Starve 3. A fan game that's like better than the original, huh? That's really interesting. And like what, is it like a tribute to Don't Starve or is it just like... ...something that looks suspiciously similar to the game? PTD6. Yes. What's the story behind BTD6? Um, While we're playing it right now, we were playing on the server earlier with a blueprint mod. We killed Bee Queen, we killed Dragonfly, we built a base, it burned down. Then we went to kill Toadstool and we died, so now we are here. And hopefully we won't die. We have submarines, they are pretty good at killing stuff. Alright, round 15. This is a hard round. There's like pink balloons and stuff. 
don't die. Like, okay, good. We survived. Next. Someone by range, I will get a ninja. If Newm Home doesn't have balloons, I'm not playing. Yeah, I think Wes just made all the balloons. And they're all just coming at us. Alright. We have a ninja, we can use that later for range. And also camo detection. I would like airburst though. Um, hmm. Oh, thank you for the money. I don't have castle, but I have Spice Islands for anyone who wants to play. Yeah. You slide in B-flow? True, if we, if we sh like, push slide in B-flow down here, he's gonna slide in a straight line and we just lost. Hmm. Okay, you know what? let's just give, like, player tree all our money. Let's see what he does with it. Maybe instead of like four subs, we get like two subs. That sounds like a plan. Less submarines, but stronger submarines. I almost got Darling. Evil West has sent the balloons to stop Maxwell from gaming. Yeah. Robo bins. Wait. If we give money to player three, he can buy a Darling gun. Oh, do it, Willa, please give him money. Please give player tree money. Yes! Darling God, where is he? But, yes! <laughs> we have the Darling Gunner. He's gonna fire down this straight line. Oh my god, look at this. Beautiful. They will never pass this. Undestructible defense. They can't get past this. It's the perfect straight line, the perfect position. He's the defender of the castle. This definitely looks like a machine gun. Alright. What's next? I'm not sure what's next. I guess we just save money. I don't think anything can get past this. Like, look at this. <laughs> it is literally the perfect spot. Get stationary b -flow to body block every balloons. Should I get hydro rocket pods? Um, apparently, I don't know if they patched this yet, but apparently Plasma Accelerator is, like, broken due to some bug. So you might want to get that. Like, I'm, I don't, I, I don't think they patched it out yet. It's a pretty recent bug. It's pretty good right now. The plasma Accelerator. Try getting the second path? No, there's no point getting the second path. It's not that good, I don't think. Unless you mean barb darts. Which may be for a start. We have darling gun now, so we're safe. You didn't use slide in B flow and we lost. Look man, there's no slide in B flow in this tower select screen, but we have Darling Gun. He is so good here. <laughs> we 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 um Combined all our powers, all our monkeys, all our money. We got a dart and you got a nut and you can get past. Hmm. The only thing that could kill us now are leads. But if I can alk buff this guy, he can pop leads then. Oh! What? How did that fail? How did that fail? It was the ultimate strategy. Alright. What if we get two Dartling guns? Give player three all your money. This time we buy two Dartling guns. Yes. You played a lot of de don't, weird don't starve mods, but this one is really weird. Yeah. Alright, now give me all your money. And we'll get a second Dartling gun. We're gonna fill this top row with Darling Guns. This cannot fail. There's no way. I came here for Raid VPN Minecraft Legends. 
You can kill a hound with 30 balloons? Huh. Wait, how much damage do... Wait, hold on. Balloons do less damage than your punches then. Because hounds have 150 health. Your punches do 10 damage. So you can kill a hound with 15 hits by punching it. But if you use balloons... Balloons do less damage than your punches. Wow. They're that bad. Oh, man. What do the balloons do when they get in the castle? I don't know what they do, but it clearly kills us. Okay. Darling Gunner isn't working. What if we spam snipers? There's a chance this works. Because the co-op starting cache is OP. Let's just spam like 0, 0, 0 snipers. And maybe... With the high ground, this will work. Why did the chat go grey? That was strange. Boy, airplane monkey. True, actually. Airplane monkey sounds... Alright. Robobin, screw the Darlton gun. Spam, yes. Spam snipers. No, uh, don't upgrade the sniper. We need more snipers. Yes. <laughs> They're popping the balloons. The sniper strategy. This will work. This is the one that carries us to victory. <laughs> Moabs will be fine. Dude, I played the Dark Souls and I died. 0 out of 10 game. We're playing balloons game because we can't die in this game. Especially not after we just discovered this broken strategy. I can pop through four layers. Crap. Alright, let's, tr let's try and actually win. <laughs> yeah, let's use snipers. Okay, don't upgrade them. Just spam the regular snipers. Like, this faster firing upgrade is more expensive than a regular sniper. That's bad. That's terrible. We have to pool our money. To player three. Maybe you can afford another sniper. How do you get the monkey your update so early? We're just uh if you kill the fuel weaver when you join the year of the beef low, there's a one percent chance you get to this screen. And it's pretty amazing. Yeah. Why is this working? Uh, player 3, buy another sniper. We need to fill this entire top path with snipers. We're gonna be at the top of the tower. Why did you give me money? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> sniper strap. It almost, we almost died, but we lived. Spike factory? Hmm. Spike Factory, that's not a bad strategy, but it costs the same amount as a Darling Gun, actually. They, they nerfed the price of this Spike Factory. I'm curious if Orange can kill some boss with 39 players against him. We did that before actually, right? With like 11 people. And I couldn't kill a boss, but no one could kill me either. What about mortars? See, mortars aren't funny, but snipers are hilarious. So that's why we're using snipers. Um, keep going. Give money to the person with the highest cash so we can buy another sniper. How much snipers is this? This is eight snipers. That's 16 damage a second, let's go. Round 15, easy. They'll never get past. My only concern is that grouped balloons might kill us. Up, up, up. Crap. Maybe snipers aren't meant to be. Alright. I, I, I have a plan. Everyone give me all your money. I have a new strategy. 
Yes. Alright. I need more money. Thank you, Willa, for the cash. How do I send the Maxwell Gaming Drawing to you? Uh, I don't think you can. Unless you add me on Steam or Discord or something. If you want that. Spike Factory. With... Yeah, with just Spike Factory. They, don't, they won't get past this. We're almost at bigger stacks. The greatest strategy. Kill enraged Klaus and Toastur at the same time with 60 people with fists and bone armor. Says the logic. That sounds terrible. Are monkeys wet? Well, you see. None of the monkeys say wet. So, Giga Chad. Why do they call him Giga Chad? Can I have money? So I can buy bigger stacks? Okay, thank you. Thank you. Please, splitter tree. Money. Ah. We're, we're surviving somehow. Spike factory strat for the win. It's working. The most overpowered strategy. One more dollar. Please, okay. Bigger stacks. Now we get like faster production or something. Um, we could play a better spike factory later. That could be the strategy if this somehow works past the early game. It is working though. Spike factory is surprisingly good. <laughs> we have to pool all our money though. So I don't think people can do much right now except give me money. I want to buy a 1-2 spike factory. I think that is the move right now, at least. You've made me sad. I made a, a handsome sad Wilson and you refuse to see him. I don't refuse to see him. Wait, um... How do I... Wait... Dude, if you wanna send me the drawing, just add me on Discord. If you're in the Don't Starve Together... Wait, no, they removed that server. Why did you place a Dart Monkey? You're not sure. We need, we need every bit of defense we can get. Reject orange, return to crossbow. You want to win? No, I don't want to win, actually. I want to win, yes. I can't see how much spikes we have, because they're all, like, under this bridge. And it blocks off the view a bit. Which is unfortunate. By the way, round 15? We just win. How are we so good? How are we so amazing? We're, the strategy is working, okay. We have a problem though. Neither of these two upgrades help us right now. So we need something else. We have to think of something else. What should we buy now? They're giving me money. So I will buy... Submarine! <sighs> I can't tell if that saved us. Or if it hurt us. Horribly. Ah! Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Please, 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 please survive. Oh, man. Yes, we're making a bank, if that's what you need. <laughs> ah, we're, we're dead, we're dead. There's no way we survive this. We're dead. We're dead. We're dead. We're dead. We're dead, yeah. Okay. Hmm. What's another stupid strategy? Who played the round? <laughs> 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 uh, 
Wait, Toasted Tunes. I sent my Discord tag up a bit. If you want to add it. And you want to add a plane? Okay, fine. Plane time. Watch this, watch this fail miserably. <laughs> Remember, uh, you asked for this. If we die, you're responsible. You should have bought another factory. Wait, dude, I don't have a Discord. Just add me on it. Just send a friend request to that. Alright. Glue Gunner. Genius! He's gonna slow the balloons down so the plane monkey can pop them. Crap. We died on the first round. Okay. <sighs> it's time to get real, boys. No more messing around with this time. Today we will win. Just use Juggernaut. I don't think that would work. But maybe it would. I t the strategy is definitely to get airburst. Or at least like two twin gun subs. Have you not, have you tried not losing? It's a really OP strat. You, you know, I never thought of just not dying. You're right. I'm gonna stop dying. Juggernaut will kill me. Trust me on that one. Do, do, we do not use the Juggernaut. This wizard has two po- oh, an alchemist. That could be useful, that could be helpful. Hmm. He's not gonna do anything right now, but he can eventually buff the submarine with the top path and pop leads. Alright, nice. You literally have a straight line? I mean, yeah, but one, the wizard kinda block the spot and also ah maybe he's just not that good why is there a defend game on a don't starve stream because we closed the server a bit ago now we're playing the superior game This Don't Starve mod looks cool. It is pretty good. We almost died there. Why does player 2 want money? Player 2 is just hoarding man money, man. He's not building anything. This is not... This is bad. Oh, man. That's a cool rook. What the hell? That's a pretty good rook. Uh-oh. Don't die. Oh, you wanted a boat. Okay, we have a pirate monkey now. Now I see why you wanted money. You guys want to see the worst spot? If you place a submarine here, he will not hit anything, but you can place him there if you want to. Uh, I saw that. That was the last red balloon that killed us. That, that was a single red balloon that killed us. That's sad, man. Engineer. This game is difficult, okay? I don't know. How about Wilbur in DST? Wilbur, the problem with Wilbur is that he doesn't throw darts. So, he's kind of a problematic person. You can do it? No. We can do it. Oh, man. Buy something, please. You guys are hoarding money. We need to we need to spend money to win. That's how this game works. We can't give in to capitalism and hoard all our cash. We have to buy towers or we lose. Simple. We're gonna die here. <laughs> Maybe we should switch to an easier map. But that's what a coward would say. That's what a weak Player tree is left. Yeah, let's go to a different map. And what what map should we play? 
Let's not do an expert. Oh god, this map, Ravine. That is a pain. Um, I have cargo chimps unlocked. I wonder... I wonder if we can beat this with the power of three random people. Okay, Mr. Man. <laughs> There's the code. I've been doing the same map for an hour. Oh, I'm surely the greatest waster of time. Do Muddy Waters chips? No. We're gonna play a slightly easier map. That definitely means we'll win. This map is, uh, it's still chimps. It's like one health, no farms, no selling. Oh, different guy this time. And Willa, one more person. We're gonna use our hero this time, maybe. I don't know. Should I switch? Kind of like... Well... Wait, open again. Yes, let's go. We all have the same hero. Perfection. The greatest strategy. Let's just spam all of them. Spam all the opens. Give, give people money so we can buy open. If we get four of them, yes, four of him. If we get four of him, we can't lose. And now player t three, I guess. I was... whatever. Monkey, monkey, monkey. We should start. We'll open it kind of like solo this round, I think. Yeah, look at him go. He deals like 2 damage per shot. Look at him. Destroying everything. Purchase the blue forest monkey. Yes, double open. Player 2. Give money to player 2. We're not getting the Wilson cab. I looked it. It is uh, strange. Put monkey as face cam? Where's Blueprint? We ended the Blueprint a while ago. Now we're doing the greater strategies. Oh my god, we got a third open! Yes! <laughs> this is how we would... Can we... Cons can be playing Wendy be considered a ghost gang? I mean, Abigail is, but like, Wendy's still alive, so I don't think Wendy's ghost can. Oban is blue and CD6 Wormwood? Maybe. I mean... Oh, player... Wait, player 2, give player 2 money, yeah. So we can buy Oban. Monkey spam. Boy Oban man, you can afford him. We just need a fort guy. <laughs> yes! Four Obans. We have won. They can't get past. Now what? Uh, hmm. Our first big problem is camel balloons. But this guy buffs magic ninja monkeys, so um Ninja's probably a smart choice. How do you play monkey game? It's on Steam for like ten dollars or something like that. I think actually during Christmas this game went on like a huge sale. It was like under a dollar or something like that. It was sick. Who bought a monkey book near up here? I don't. I would advise you to not use water towers on this map because this, all the spots are kind of bad. What was the red Hamlet old guy called? You mean Warbucks, the removed guy? He was like available in like a super early early access version of Hamlet. And then and then they clay removed him for some reason. We will never know why. Oh nice ninja. 
I guess I'll just give money to Player 3, because they can upgrade Ninja and not help us not die to Camo Bloons. I have expo- oh god, Big Chungus has exposed me. I'm actually an orange. Oh no. <gasps> Purple Bloons killed us! Oh crap, I forgot they existed. Okay. We can't only spam Oban because uh, purple balloons are immune to him. So we'll need a bit more. After we get Oban, we'll need um, ninjas, I guess. Ninja spam. Look, I remember Warbooks. He's the greatest, worst character ever. Nice, two Obans. But right now... <laughs> this game is hard, man. Especially with three people. If you play with a four-player game in this game, everyone shares cash, so you get... Because of that, you get a quarter of the cash you normally get. So I'm basically playing with a quarter of the cash. Unless people give me money. <laughs> Let's give player two money so we can buy open. Warbucks got caught for being British. I don't think that's the reason. I, I remember, I actually remember his stats. He had three stats and they were all pretty bad. His first one was that like, um, whenever he mined artifacts with the ball peen hammer, it took less durability off the ball peen hammer, which like, that's not that's not that helpful or interesting. The other one was that if he had like the more money he had in his pocket, the higher sandy his sandy would go up, which is interesting, I guess. And his downside was that if he ate anything uncooked, he lost sanity. Which was like just a discount Warly. I mean they could have probably just reworked his starts stats, but I guess they just removed him. Actually, I remember something about him now. Why he was so good. Whenever you attacked something as Warbucks... Yeah, 30 Sandy a minute, but whenever you attacked something as Warbucks, he made this, like, trumpet sound. It was so good. Oh, I remember that. It was like... I don't even remember what the trumpet sound was, but whenever you attacked something, he made, like, this trumpet sound. It was so good. That was the best part of his character. Whenever you fought something, he made a trumpet sound. Wasn't he the one with the shotgun? I think he had a shotgun in his picture, but he didn't actually have a shotgun. <laughs> I'm British and I'm not in Dold Starve. I expected to see Dold Starve when I saw balloons. Yeah, we've moved past the server. Why is there a sniper? We're trying some... Okay, I guess we won't get the fourth Tobin, but that's probably smart, because um, purples will kill us then. <laughs> Four of the same hero. Masterpiece. He had a Blunderpuss? He had a Blunderbluss? Isn't the Blunderbuss a, like, regular Hamlet thing? I could be wrong, because I, like, never craft it, but... Wait, let me search this up. Don't starve Hamlet blunder bus. It is the blunder bus is a craftable weapon exclusive to the Hamlet DLC. It is found in the fight tab. Yeah. It's just a regular Hamlet weapon. Also we dealt with purples this time. Just joined what's happening. We were playing Don't Starve earlier, we killed Dragonfly, killed the Bee Queen, we went to Toadstool. And then we died. Everyone actually died. So now we're playing balloons because it is clearly the superior game. Um, I think I am gonna. I wonder how much people, how much of the guys here know the secret on this map. There's a, there's a. Let's just say there's a big surprise on this map. Blunder. Blunderbuss used to be Warbucks exclusive, but now it's not. That might have been it. 
Don't balloons TD6, yeah. But yeah, there's a pretty big secret on this map. It might screw us over and it might kill us actually. Just be prepared for the Moab, that's all I'll say. It's this map is pretty rough. What about balloons don't starve? I mean, B Don't Starve has uh, West Balloons and also Blow Darts. Blow Darts. So, it, you, it, could, it could count as BTD6 in Don't Starve. But yeah, on this map, on round 40, there's a... The, the map kind of changes a bit and it's gonna screw us over quite a bit. I hope people are ready for that. Can this ninja solo all camo waves? I don't think it can. We have brambles, so that's fine. Oban has the ability which places brambles on the track, which will pop camos actually. So that's useful. Um, I think we're dead. I don't know. I'm kind of scared. I don't like this at all. The Moab's gonna kill us. We're just getting chased by 20 plus players. Oh yeah, on the Don't Starve server we got chased by a bunch of people, but they weren't trying to kill me. They were just giving me stuff, which is interesting. Um... Oh, nice, open. I don't know what to get. I feel like everything could kill us right now. Uh, there's a big jump scare on round 40 on this map, and I'm afraid of it so much. I don't think anyone... Judging by where these guys are placing their towers, I don't think they know what it is. Get main Moab. We can't afford it. It's like... 5,000, 8,000, almost $10,000. And I think the ceramics will kill us. I think we can pop them more, but ceramics will probably kill us. It's very late for me. Well, good night, Skiwi. It's 10 for me. All right, next round. Leave it on slow mode. Round 40, this map is going to change. It's going to blow your mind. I gave you that battle helmet and you gave me the flower crown. How would she? Prepare for round 40. It is most likely that round. Actually, once round 40 hits, spam this ability. Spam that, ab spam Oban's ability the second round 40 hits. We will need it. <laughs> we'll start spamming F in the chat. Wait, not now. Oh no. Not now. The trucks move and the Moab passes down here. <laughs> oh no, we're dead. <laughs> yeah, so now you know what happens on round 40. Um, the Moab path is down there. It's a bit of a trap. Is he done with DST today? Yep. <laughs> Oh man, that 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 one is just th th this map is evil. We have to prepare for that in advance. Like the the cars just suddenly move and a Moab comes. These cars probably drown. Actually, where do they go? You can't go on water. AFK. Oh man. <laughs> F in the chat. Don't worry boys, we will we will defeat we will defeat the Moab. I don't know how we'll do it, but we will do it. Which blueprint is this? I'm not sure. I need a blueprint to defeat the Moab, because that was very hard. Hmm. Maybe if we all... If the, like, brambles just got better RNG and they spawned on this track instead of that track. 
they could have helped with the moab a lot and maybe helped us beat it i don't know what's the right move to kill it honestly maybe a submarine with armor piercing because if we put him like here maybe and then he can seed all the way here you can pop the moab as it's going down and then defeat it I think that's the strategy. Desktop is my favorite game. Hey YouTube, can I stream for Don't Star? I actually plays Bloods like a boss, monkey time. Play Google Chrome. Um, no. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm, I'm going full in with the substrat. It's a bit expensive, but he can... Full map range is just good in this game. You can see this whole track. Who wants money? You want Oban? Oh! He's gonna place it there. Interesting spot. I like how his spot changed with the knowledge of where the Moab comes in. My favorite game is Chrome Search History. You should play it afterwards. No. 10 tier dog? He wants to leave the room. I think. Yep. Alright, the dog has left the room. He does not like me dying to monkey game, I guess. Are we dead here? We don't have as much opens as we did last time. Oh yes, brambles. Perfect. Maxwell is playing Flappy Bird Mobile. I thought he's playing balloons, cause he could he could be he could be playing anything really. How did we die? Guys, we need more Obans. I don't think you understand. We pick we all picked Oban for a reason. It's so we can win. Console server when? I don't think you can make a console server. As sad as that is, you can only host servers on PC. Play turn off PC button. Funny, funny thing actually. There's a button on my keyboard that um, will completely turn off the PC if I touch it. So theoretically, I could accidentally end the stream and just turn off my entire PC by hitting this one button. That's on my keyboard. Give Banker of Brinner of Doom some money. He's so close to open. If you place a spike factory, will it put spikes on the secret Moab path? Yeah, that's how it works. Like right now, right now this path is just a bunch of trucks. You can't really see past them, but on round 40 when the Moab comes, they'll move past and then they won't be blocking off as a wall anymore. What blueprint is Moab drop ceramics? Fix Mo find Moab assassin blueprint by popping ceramic blooms. It's zero point seven five percent chance. Yeah, if we if we use bramble enough times, we get a blueprint for uh, popping the Moab. What characters are you hoping to get reworked next? Um, realistically, the next character is Weber, and if it's not Weber, it's like Maxwell. I don't... I'm not hoping for any character to get reworked, because I think... What I wanted, like, ages ago was for Clay to... Make characters... There's a lot of, there was, like, a lot of characters in the game that were just bad. And with the character reworks, I think Clay fixed that. And I don't really care about Clay reworking the better characters as much, because they're just good and now they're be slightly better. So I'm not. it's not like I'm hoping for reworks, even though they're kind of cool. Although I wonder what they're going to do with Weber, considering Worked is basically... Is, Worked is basically another Weber, right? Like, sh she has the same downside of... Pigs hate her, 
and the whole building in tins. And then the whole tin of Merm's not hating her like Weber has the spiders not hitting him. They're kind of very similar characters, so I'm really interested to see what they would do to make the two different, what they would do to Weber to change him. Wartox needs a rework to make him starve a thousand percent faster. Wartox will get reworked so he's not as strong. Uh, I'm not sure if Clay will rework characters to make them worse. I don't know if they're gonna do that. Like, they might do that, but... I don't know. Like, when you when you rework a character because he's, like, bad, and they need to be better, like, that makes sense, right? No one's gonna complain that you made a bad character good. But if you make a good character bad, there's someone that's not going to be happy with that change. And I, in my opinion, I don't think any of the characters can be need to be nerfed. Because if you believe one of the characters is like overpowered, you can just like not play them. I don't think there's a point for moving things. Also, we're fine for leads, right? Yes, okay. So this open has vision here. Open gives us vision here. This sub gives us vision here. So we have vision on the mob for basically the whole track. Clay should give Wilson an ICBM to instantly destroy any power to the map with any button press. Weber will become Spider-Man. He basically is Spider-Man though. Why do the why do I feel like the balloons are getting far? Oh, purples. Are we safe? We're safe. What blueprint do ceramics drop? They drop rainbows. Are we fine on ceramics? I mean camos. I guess the sub can see here. Hmm. I think in like two rounds there's like five camo whites, which I don't know if this ninja can handle. That might be bad for us. Brambles saved us there, potentially no- Oh my god, that was such good timing! Bringer of Doom, holy shit those brambles. They were so well timed. There will be no west rework. Technically, they re re reworked West's last April Fools. I have a theory that Clay will rework Wilson this April Fools, and they're gonna do the same thing where they change nothing about him. That's my theory. That th there might actually be a Wilson rework, but it's just like on April Fools, and they don't actually do anything. Dude, someone Shadow Puppet? Of course. Shadow Puppet will pop the balloons. Genius. Let me get a glue gunner. Help with the ceramics maybe? I don't know. I couldn't get the upgrade I wanted because I'm playing in a quarter cash because four players, so... I have to make do what little money I have. I'm gonna go sleep now. Good night, Wuchi. Lads, this glue gunner is doing actual work. What the hell? Um, brambles. Yeah. He might have clumped the balloons. Oh, white balloons. This is what I was afraid of, but we actually. That was really easy. Okay. So. Remember. On round 40, not before round 40. On round 40, use brambles and pray that they land on the moab path. We need as much damage for the moab as we can get. So on round 40, use brambles. So he places them on the moab path. We have to do it. Yep, we have Maxwell Gaming in the bottom left. It's actually the perfect spot, nothing's there. 
You know, I could have placed a submarine under Maxwell and no one would ever be able to tell. Look at that, you can't see him, even though he's there. Crazy. Okay, next round, spam brambles. I might place a druid, because he does a little bit good of damage. Let's put a bit more druids. The second this round ends, spam brambles. No, 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 use the music. Good bramble spot. Come on, please. Please! Oh. How do I get open blueprint? Okay, Orange, tell us what's going to be happen of the outcome of all those Wilson versus Vortox pools. Should we switch map? Let's go to a really easy map. I'm sick of dying, man. <laughs> oh, man. Cracked? Cracked chimps? Sure. So, I don't want to spoil where the Wilson versus Vortox is going. He didn't get the Flying Fortress blueprint, but... I don't want to spoil where the w Wilson versus Wartox blueprint, I mean, polls are going. But basically, in the 25k special, there will be, you will understand, it will be epic. Okay, we have Skiwi. So this map is like stupid easy, there's no way we can die. There's no water though, unless we remove um, this rock. So no submarines, but that's fine. It's so long. Look at the length of this thing. This is so simple compared to all the other maps. There's no way we can lose. Why the Maxwell Gaming? So, tell me, at one point does w w Maxwell become wide? Is it when I stretch him? Like this? Uh, like this? Or is it when I stretch him? Like this? Which one is wide? When I put him to the right or when I move him down? It's an interesting, highly philosophical question about which Maxwell is the wide Maxwell. Um, yeah, let's give Will a money for open. But yeah, this map is so easy. We can't die. The, the Moab on the last map was stupid difficult. This, this round, the Moab is just gonna die. I don't even have to look at the screen, it's gonna die. Put him to the left, put him to the right. Horizontally wide. Right, okay. I guess right is right. Uh, let's stretch him. Because remember, now he has a wider phone, which means he can see more of the game, which means he's better. He has become better at the game. Thank you guys for the tips on how to when you pull him to the y-axis. <laughs> yeah, that's basically what I did. Alright, player tree needs open now. So I'm actually not sure which tower to buy because I only have a quarter cash. Even though we could all pull our money together, but I don't want to depend on that. So I think I'm gonna just try and support what other people are doing. Why is there a tax shooter over there? Chat, what should I buy? Which monkey should I get? Which, which of these monkeys is the superior monkey? Which of these monkeys looks closest to the rook? Which of these monkeys is the best monkey? I need to know. Wider? Alright, wider max will it is. Let's cover this entire bottom section of the map. There we go. <laughs> it looks like he just put his phone closer to his face. He's gonna get some serious eye damage from that. It's not gonna be going any good. Glue farm? Dude, there's no I can't get farms. I can't get a farm. There is no farm, it's chimps mode. <laughs> Ace? 
Oh, actually, Ace is not a bad idea. I'm gonna get Ace. Sure. Maybe you can play Sky Strider. It's really expensive, so I doubt it, but... Operation Dartstorm and Fighter Plane are really good. So I'll buy Ace. What do you mean that's not wide enough? <laughs> Fine. We're gonna use the y-axis to make him wider. Oh my god. I need to learn how to use OPS properly and not mess this up. We're using the y-axis, he's more wide now. <laughs> the distance between his phone and his face has made smaller. Look, we made Maxwell wider and now we're not dying. I think there's a correlation between those two. By just making Maxwell wider, we die less. I look away for a minute and I look back, Maxwell is wider. You want him wider than this? He needs to cover the screen? Okay. We're gonna reach wideness levels that were, like, were never seen before. Are you ready for this? There. <laughs> He's squished. He is at uh, his peak wideness. He's as wide as he can possibly be. Like, the phone has become his face. He is as wide as possible. He cannot become wider. I'm sorry, man. He just can't become wider. He was run over by a truck. <laughs> yes, no. What do you guys want? He's in pain? What do you mean, man? He's just gaming. There's a difference. Perfection. Oh, a wall of fire at the end. That's kind of smart, actually. So this fighter plane fires Moab missiles, which will take care of the Moab pretty easily. As if we weren't fine. Oh, thank you for the money. Now we just save for Operation Dart Storm. Cover the screen with Maxwell. If we don't see the balloon, it means they don't exist. What if... Instead of covering the screen with Maxwell... Oh, I have a fun idea. <laughs> oh no. Why did you tell me to cover the screen with Maxwell? I have a new idea now. So basically, what if we just like, replace all the monkeys with Maxwell? See this Maxwell shooter? See this Maxwell shooter? He's firing tax over there. <laughs> yeah, Maxwell's pretty amazing. Um, why do we have a pilot? Got a heli pilot, that's pretty cool. Maxwell tax shooter. He's just staring at the blues. That looks super off. I I think we have a we have a mob mauler. There's an actual there's a pretty good strategy where you literally just spam mob maulers. Like it it works good against moabs and it works really well against normal blues for some reason. We could do that. It's a good way to be round 100 pretty easily. That wizard carried, yeah. That mob was pretty close. We're so close to Operation Dart Storm. It's actually not too bad. Oh, we have it. Now we get sharper darts. And then I think we get a village with camo. And jungle drums for faster attack speed. We just buff him. We don't need to do too much. We, we, we're we actually... Wilson PNG next to Maxwell. <laughs> uh, but in this game you, you can pretty much buy whatever you want. Especially on like the shorter, longer maps like this one. And it'll work up until like around 80 so... We're fine for a bit. We don't have to do too much. 
I will buy camo detection on my ace though. And for the obens, it buffs them as well. Oh, you dug up the rock. We can place submarines here now, except I can't because that's not my area apparently. Thanks game, I appreciate it. Look at that mob get destroyed there. Wilson be the mob baller? <laughs> yes, Wilson has joined the army, thank you. Let's get Wilson as the Moab Mauler. He will use his forehead to punch those Moabs. Let's go. Alright. Moab Mauler is like here. Um, maybe I could turn Wilson. How do I turn? Oh, how do I turn Wilson? I'm not sure. Let's just leave him there. Wilson Mauler. He uses science. When the Maxwell is sus. <laughs> we have two wonderful towers. Amazing. I love it. Okay, camel detection. Good. The two opens, I think... The submarine has camel detection. These two opens have camel detection. And my ace has camel detection. And all of those, all of those will also get jungle drums for like 20% faster attack speed, which is uh, really good, surprisingly. There we go. Now the question becomes, we need Willow for the magicians. Oh, I just, re this looks so off when I open a uh, tower. Because now Maxwell is just on here. It looks kind of bad, but we'll, <laughs> we'll just ignore that exists. Wormwood open. I mean, sure. Uh, are we fine? Oh yeah, because open is camo, so we're fine for camo. That's, yeah. Wait, uh, hold on. Before we spam more Don't Starve characters, how are we against round 63? It's a round with a bunch of ceramics. A bit too much ceramics. And I'm not sure if we can handle them. Um, how... I guess I'll just Elk buff my ace. There's an Alchemist buff that makes him stronger. Why did I get a... Okay. It gives him more damage and other stuff. So, we need to survive 63. Uh oh. Look at that. Big wave. There's a lot of balloons here. Uh oh. Don't fast forward. <laughs> we survived. There's two more waves of that. This round's pretty rough. It could kill you really easily if you're not careful. We're barely surviving it, actually. We have to start getting some serious defenses, I think. One more wave of a bunch of ceramics. There's so much of them. I used the brambles. Maybe it'll help a bit. What the hell? Okay, we survived. Max Mobile Gaming has been run over. Look. Move Wilson down and stretch him upwards. Yes, okay, I have a super monkey. I guess we'll continue to alchemist buff my monkey ace with stronger stimulant. Yeah. And then I think we have a submarine, we have a super monkey. We should be fine until round 80. Past round 80, the ceramics get like quadruple health or something ridiculous like that. And the Moabs start having more health, so um, the rounds get a fair bit more difficult after round 80. Which um, could be a big problem for us. Well, that's in 14 rounds. We'll be fine. Tall Wilson. What if? You see that village up there? Hold on. The dog 
dog is back. We are winning and the dog has returned. This is what Shipwreck was supposed to be before they decided to include every other character except for Wilbur. I agree. Do you know what else I agree with? Wait, do I not have the do I not have tent? I don't have the don't starve tent, that's a shame. Well I'll use a science machine. That's right, they established the base here. This village is actually a science machine. Uh, there we go. Science is helping them. Perfect. They established a base on this map. Can I upgrade this alchemist? Yeah, I can. Where are the balloons getting far? Wait. There's three Moab Maulers. Do we just spam Moab Maulers? Is that the strategy we're gonna go for? His primary expertise, which makes them stronger. Do we just spam Moab Maulers? It's a legit strat that will work. If we want to do it. It sounds like a joke strategy to just spam these bombs but it, it's a working one i might do it hmm we need a crock pot for that science machine if only we could use the banana farm it could be the crock pot yeah hmm i guess they'll just have to make do with that science machine over there Use the light from the crock pot to survive the night. Yeah, that works. Uh, primary mentoring, tier 1 upgrades for free. I might buy this before I start my bomb spam, because then... If I place any bombs around the village, all these upgrades will be free, so that's pretty good. It saves you a lot of cash if you spam. Greenfoot, is it secretly related to Wormwood? Probably. Honestly. Round 76 has a lot of regrows. Uh oh, uh oh, regrow farm? Are they gonna kill us? Don't kill us. Don't kill us! I actually thought we were gonna die there. Don't scare me like that. Christ, oh man. Oh man, that was really close to dying. Maybe I'll start the bomb spam now. We have to get as many bombs in as early as possible. Yeah, I'll just buy some. Moab Mullers, let's go. The greatest strategy. We can beat round 100 this way. I have to commit now. I have to commit, go by and have a nice epic gameplay. Goodbye, Miss Dragon. Why do we have balloons? Why do we hate balloons all of a sudden? I wouldn't call it all of a sudden. Like, we had balloons and don't starve, like the West balloons. And realistically, I don't think anyone liked those. So. Yeah, we don't, we, we hated balloons for a long time. Also, every time they reach the end, we kind of die and lose, so. Moabs, yeah. You know what's funny? If I spam this over and over again. Uh oh. Camels. Uh, okay. Sorry, Orange. I can't give credit. Come back when you're a little mm, richer. Amazing. If you say no kill, then they can't kill because they can't kill you without permission. Yeah. Uh, the balloons don't speak. They have like eyes, but they don't have a mouth, so... They don't have ears either. They kind of just float. Um, let's get some more Moab Maulers. If someone up here could spam Moab Maulers, that could be great. Actually... Here's a good bomb against uh, like clumped balloons, like ceramics. Recursive cluster with bigger bombs and heavy bombs. That's really good. Wouldn't the Muller be best up front though? Yeah. 
But the thing is, it's co-op and I can't place anywhere up here. Although, um, little known fact, Moab Muller does more damage to normal balloons as well. So it's actually just good if you spam it. Even in a bad spot like this. Just spamming Moab Mollers can actually get you to win. Also, we have officially hit round 81, so now ceramics are stronger. This is where the game gets a bit difficult. Um, I think we should. someone should buy a Moab glue. This guy. So we can slow down the Moabs. Balloons are secretly the souls of the dead monkeys. That they are merely trying to escape the afterlife, but the living monkeys stop them. That's an interesting theory. I mean, by that logic, wouldn't the balloons be zombies? I guess it makes sense to kill a zombie. By the way, player 3 or player 2, please buy a Moab glue. It will actually help immensely. It's only like $4,000. It is like one of the be th the best upgrades in this game. Moab glue is just amazing. We have a cursive cluster now, so that's good. You need a West skin for the Zeppelins, <laughs> maybe. Hmm. Nice. They're spamming some Moab molars. And we're getting a Moab glue. Yes. We're gaming. Look at the Moab models just destroying everything up there. I'm back from making horrible creatures only Maxwell variants. Huh. Look at look at the uh, like you thought I was kidding with the Moab models, but they're working. There's like five of them and they're destroying the Moabs. And the ceramics. So I'm thinking right now that if I can't buff them from down here, I could give cash. I, I was thinking though of buying a balloon sabotage, this guy. It makes all, it's an ability, makes all the balloons move half speed. Which should help people up here, which could be good. You should play orange roulette what's the name of this dst mod it's the greatest dst mod it uh it turns it's it turns dst into a different game two zomgs look how fast they're about to die gonna be no problem for the moab maulers look at that grouped moab damage they can't get past Oh, actually, I know what I should get. Shattering shells. I have to buy a mortar. And then he can remove fortification off of blimps, which... Um, fortify the blimps have double health. So if you can remove that with this upgrade, that's like basically one of the best upgrades. So I might get that later to help people up, up front. I'm going to go, but if you need... But I need you to promise me to create a tall Wilson plane on a science machine. All right, goodbye, toasted tunes. If the balloons are zombies, how does Necromancer Monkey reanimate balloons again? Is it turning zombies into zombies again? Maybe he's turning zombies... Like... Because typically, when you think of a zombie, they're like a threat, right? Like, they're meant to kill you. So maybe the Necromancer just... Makes them not want to kill you, and instead kills the other zombies. Like why 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 would why would zombies naturally want to attack humans? It doesn't really make sense. Also DTTs. I'm gonna use trees here. They're kinda scary. Cause they're fast. Oh wow. Uh our our, our our DTT popping power is horrible. We have to buy something to stop them. This is the time where you have to start thinking about pooling our money together to buy something good. I don't know what that could be. 
We need something that's really good against TTTs. Wait, what heli pilot is this? Where is he? Where does this heli pilot come from? Huh? Wait. Oh, here is hidden under the tree. Downdraft. That's good. I will be seen in chat by people that watch this. Hmm. Permabrew? Permabrew is 64,000, which I don't think we can get right now. Um, I'm thinking like a spike factory, but that's just too expensive. Oh no, it's not that many cheap DTT options that can kill them really fast. Uh, rename the stream to streaming Defined your blueprints mod, but we actually play BTD6. The thing is, I can't rename the stream, which is kind of sad. Okay, I'm gonna buy Bloom Sabotage. Because at least that helps with DTTs, but it's not gonna save us. Unless everyone who is open uses. Okay. When it gets around 95, I want everyone to use their trees ability, like the second ability. That spawns the trees. That's the if we have enough trees, it could eat up all the DTTs. And that might be that might be our only option to. If you go middle path on helicopter, uh, this is. Why? <laughs> Killed us, I wasn't looking. Did a DDT make it past? Was that what happened? Oh man. We died. Dog killed us. Sabotage from among guns. Eat the dog. Wait, hold on, how on? Well, I apparently have been streaming for three and f three hours and forty minutes, so I'm gonna end it there. All right, thank you to everyone who joined earlier in this. Alright, uh, yeah. Thank you to everyone who joined the server earlier and whoever sticked on with the dumb balloon stream. But I'm gonna end it there. Oh, Maxwell. Goodbye.